Hi everyone, I'm Audrey. And I'm Anthony. Together we are Rianne. Audrey? Yes. How are you doing tonight? I'm doing well. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm a little jealous of you. Because? Because you got that tofu. I do. Tofu's all over me. He's always <laughs> jumping in your lap. I know, right before we go live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He likes a certain position, right? Yeah. He just has his butt up against you, and then he just mashes your keyboard. Pretty much. Yeah, pretty <laughs> much. It's like half his body on the desk uh -huh. and half on my lap. But now, I think since we've gone live and I've like raised my voice a little yeah, bit, he's now he's feeling like a little bit, this is too much. Imminent tofu departure. Yeah, he was like, I wanted a nap, but now but now I don't know about Now this. I'm live. Yeah. Oh, see? Yeah, there he goes. There he is. <laughs> Oh he's yeah, he's loud, really leaving. Loud. I'm sorry. Okay, he just left the room. All right. Anyway. He bounced. <laughs> he bounced. We're doing good. How's everyone doing in hey, chat? Val, Val, Lou, how are you doing? What's up? Happy times out and Lou. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Appreciate both you guys being here. Happy so New nice. Year. This is my first stream of the oh, new year. Oh right? yeah. Happy and New Year. You had your first one, um Monday. Monday, yeah. Yes. Sorry. Karina of time. Hmm? Did you ask me a question? No, I just a happy new year. Oh yeah, happy new year to you. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you guys. Yeah, thank you, Valborn. Um, the year did start well. It just feels like yeah. suddenly we're in a new year. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like happy new year. Okay, it feels back. like it's like building up to something, and it's like, hey, it's the same <laughs> a little yeah. bit, you know, no, uh, nothing crazy different, but that's okay. Yeah, yeah. happy with more it's of the good. same. Yeah, yeah. Lou says Tofu's good. camera shot. He is. He is. But then here's Ipo. He Ipo's is. In the room now. Yeah, Tofu was like all up in the background of my stream on Monday, mm -hmm. though. So, you know, I oh, think for sure, yeah. he, he kind of had enough of uh, enough camera time. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, here we Happy are. New Year. Yeah, it's, uh, oh, yeah, you, we blinked and suddenly 2021 was over. Yeah, it feels like we skipped over 2021 into 2022. Kind of weird, yeah. right? It's, it's zipped by. Yeah, sure. I yeah. It still feels like we're in this thing called we are. a pandemic. Yeah, <laughs> and it's like I'm I, I'm like constantly on standby. I'm like, okay, just hold on until this thing is over, and then we can resume. But it's been like that for like almost two years now. Yeah, so, you know. Yeah, but it's okay. Pretty we're much. hanging in there. Hanging and in hope there. you guys are as well. Mm -hmm. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah. So we're continuing Metal Gear Solid. This is our third stream of it. However, our first two were kind of shorter because Only we had thir the third one. Yeah, it's not okay. a super long game in terms of the pace. Things just keep happening. I was gonna right? say it feels like a lot has happened. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Okay. And um, our first two streams were a little shorter because we had things going on. I forgot what happened with the first stream, but the second mm -hmm. stream we had Rainy Rumble, so it was a short, shorter Metal Gear stream. Right. Right. But here we are Rainy today. Rumble. Nothing else going on. Rainy Rumble, indeed. Yeah, about isn't 2022 also 2022? Yeah, it is. I love yeah, that. That's yeah. funny. You're right, Valborn. Got it twice. Whoa, Lou. Undefeated. That's scary, Lou. Hope you're feeling okay. Oh, yeah. Sheesh. Yeah. Metal Gear Solid. Do you remember everything? Fortunately, we remember that there's a, a mission log feature when you load your save file. It gives you a little recap of what happened mm. last time. Mm. But, um,. Shall I lead a uh, brief recap of what's yeah. going on? Please, uh, and, and in the in the tone and language of the game, I'm oh, just maybe kidding. okay. <laughs> oh, maybe well, should we? I I should put some filter on our cameras and oh, just do like yes! like talking at the camera, like, <laughs> and then we can dub over ourselves. Meryl. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that'd be fun, actually. So at the beginning of the last stream, our objective was to find Hal Emmerich an engineer on the Metal Gear project, mm. he might be able to help us stop this thing because President Baker, mm -hmm. the arms tech president, gave up his nuclear codes. Mm -hmm. But there's hope in the PAL card, some kind of right. emergency card to shut off the nuclear launch. Right. We don't know a ton about it, but Baker told us that he was in communications with Merrill. And yes. That she knows about it. Yes. We talk to Meryl. Meryl tells tells us about Hal Emmerich, engineer, mm -hmm. and that we can get to him in some other building. Mm -hmm. She says, "I want to help," and he's like, "You're too green." She's like, "Well, I I I have the access or whatever. Yeah. I can open the door, so you gotta accept my help." Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Raptor, what's up? Let's save the world and hey, hey, yeah, that's pretty right. serious stuff going on. Saving the world. On the way, we go outside in the canyon and fight Vulcan Raven. Vulcan? Yeah. 
Vulcan Raven. In the tank. Yeah, they I remember that. Tank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then as we walk away, you threw, you him, threw a, a a pineapple. A pineapple. That's right. Into the into the tank. Yeah, that was pretty cool. And um, as we were leaving leaving though, we we saw a little conversation on the radio between Raven and presumably Ocelot. Oh no no no! Liquid. Liquid. Wasn't Ocelot? Was Ocelot there? Or no. How come I remember? I don't, that? We may have seen some scenes with him. Okay, okay. But it, it was wasn't like that one in particular. Okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then Raven was like, "You're right. He is strong, or whatever." Ah. Uh, well, we, I will meet him again, or something like that. Meet him in battle again. Yeah, yeah. We proceed go through going through this nuclear storage room. Don't shoot your weapons, right? Mm-hmm. Toxic. Mm, right. Stuff's leaking. Yeah. But we get through to Hal Emmerich, the engineer. Yes. Who you had an I'm, inkling that you knew who this character was going to be. I didn't the know game. the name. Um, I didn't know the name, but uh, I didn't know the name Hal Emmerich. Yes. But when the when you see him and then you hear that he's kind of a weeb, right? Then I was like, oh, you know, I to? know this character. Yeah. 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 Yes. Otacon. Yeah. Audrey's general knowledge of the Metal Gear series included a character named Otacon. Yeah. It's, it's, I mostly know it because of the trivia of the name. It's like, oh, this character's name because there's an actual like anime Otaku convention, convention yeah. called yeah, Otacon. And, yeah. And then and we joked that if like, oh. this game was made today, yeah. would his name instead be Weeaboo? <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe not. No, that's um, too direct. Yeah. Otacon actually, maybe maybe it's because of the game. But you can call sounds... me Weeaboo. Yeah. <laughs> but um, oh, God. we we first find him because he's being confronted by that cyborg ninja. Mm-hmm. We fight the ninja. Yeah. I thought I I totally misplaced the this cyborg ninja. And I, I think a lot it... of people in chat knew knew you were oh. thinking something else yeah i because i thought it was another character uh-huh. it turns out this cyborg ninja ninja the reveal is that it's gray fox from who, zanzibar land from in the zanzibar first land. in the in metal gear yeah and he's he's a famed soldier as well yeah i right? worked with um he he seemingly died yeah seemingly died in metal gear twice. 2 i think so so in metal gear 2 he supposedly died mm-hmm and then it turns out we learned from Miss Dr. Naomi Hunter. Naomi Hunter. And Naomi Hunter's like, oh, well, actually, they recovered the body from Zanzibar land. Yeah. And sketchy foxhound activities so after, after Solid Snake and Roy Campbell leave. Yeah. Retire. Yeah. Foxhound does some crazy experimentations, put in an experimental exoskeleton and drugged him for four years. Kept him asleep, Gray Fox, to use his uh, DNA to create these genome Super soldiers. Super soldiers. Yeah. Yeah. But apparently some explosion with the uh, the the <laughs> the, the pre- uh, Naomi Hunter's, Hunter's predecessor, yeah. Dr. Clark seemingly died. Uh-huh. And then Gray Fox was seemingly dead, but apparently not. Yeah. So there's that. Yeah. Disappears. Cool bo- Cool fight. Yeah. He's still, lo- he's still around. Yeah. Yeah. I think on a normal difficulty or harder difficulty, there's a... Um, fourth wall breaking um, element to the fight. Oh. Please, before I tell Audrey any more, in case I'm wrong, does anyone in chat know, is this the, where you could have controller port oh. to? I thought that, that was a different else? fight. I knew about that. Oh, okay. Th- that's a different fight. Oh, wait, fight. wait, wait. Paradox, that was this fight? What? Or is that another thing later? No, it's something else later? Okay, something else later. Okay. You got one coming. Okay. <laughs> say no more. Say no more. Okay. I, I think I know that one. I think But there's there's crazy stuff like that. Well Wait, well, there's more than that? There's crazy stuff in this game. Oh, I'm so excited. I did not know about the looking on the back of the the box one. Which was awesome. For Merrill's um yeah. frequency. Uh-huh. I do I know about the controller one and I know I think I know what fight that's for. Okay, okay. Well we'll get there. Maybe I'm misremembering. Okay, okay. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Lots more? It's just fun. I love it. Yeah, it's, it's so fun. I love that stuff. So <laughs> afterwards, we finally get to talk with um, Hal Emmerich and get the nickname Otacon. Yeah. What do you? What have you learned about Hal Emmerich's involvement with um, Shadow Moses Island, the um, Metal Gear Rex project? Rex yeah. is the name, right? And his family, family history. Oh. Hal Emmerich, Otacon's history. 
I don't remember. I just I remember his intentions were good, but yes. then it was revealed to him like, oh no, actually this is a nuclear tank, weapon missile tank launching. So yeah, but, yeah, yeah, he he's an engineer on it, but the teams were separated. He was thinking it was a defense system this whole time. Oh, he thought it was a right. missile defense system. Right. Yeah, he had it all. They wrong. used them. A missile defense system that you, we would need to equip n- nukes with. But that's the thing. That's what I was saying. They separated the team, so another team oh, was working on the weapons. Oh, right. So he didn't, he didn't see the full bl- blueprints. Oh, okay. That's how you do it. He didn't see the full blueprints. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. And we learned that what his great grand or his grandfather oh, worked on the Manhattan yes. Project. Tell yes. me more. Yes. It was just. It just seems to be this. His. <laughs> history, his family history seems to be tied with weapons of mass destruction. Yeah. What um, was his father though? He I don't said. remember. But all, all three generations of Emmerich men. Yeah, and he and he was trying to kind of break that cycle. He thought that this this trapped. project was that. But then he was like, "Damn, I'm I'm just like my you know the my, curse of nu- nuclear the people weapons before me." Yeah, I was, uh, that was pretty. Yeah, cool. I remember you had a good reaction to that. That it just sounded yeah. Like it's too epic. <laughs> like a cosmic joke on his. Family, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So, Emmerich's. um, the the game will probably give us a briefing of exactly what our, our um objective right mm-hmm. now is, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. since cool. I don't exactly remember. But Hal is going to be like um the the our inside man. Mm-hmm. He has mm-hmm. stealth camo, so oh, he yeah, can that's hide, right. yeah. so he can stay safe. Uh, he has an injury. He has like a he has like a hurt his leg, leg, leg or something, or something. Like that, yeah. So he was like limping around. Yeah. He also peed himself. You remember when we first got there? Oh, oh yeah, I forgot yeah. about that. Um, he did. He did. Yeah. Um, so I don't remember exactly what our objective is. We'll find out right now. Okay. I think it was that maybe Meryl had the pal card or something like that. But we literally ended the game right after that fight. Okay. So, so we'll pick up after that. Um, cool. Let's uh, catch up with chat real quick. I'm going to yeah. scroll back Blossom up. says, I know Hal is a fairly common name, but knowing Kojima, it's almost surely reference to 2001 A Space Odyssey. I think so too. Yeah? Most likely. I actually he does seen, a ton of film references. I haven't seen that movie. Me neither. Um, I've but, seen parts. For but sure. for some reason, I swear it's like within the past couple of weeks, it's come up several times in my everyday. Certainly, yeah. So it seems to be we pretty influential. It. Yeah, I think I need to watch it. But I know the name Hal for sure. And Lou, thank you for the well wishes. Yeah, we're doing our best to stay safe. Yes, it's crazy. yes. Crazy out here. And yes, Paradox is here. How are you doing? Hey, Paradox. Um. Ooh, reference to that in Fight 4. I'm so excited for these fights. How many more... Um, Foxhound folks, do we... Who do you know we, so far? We know Liquid Snake. Oh, he counts as one. Yeah, yeah. Revolver Ocelot. Yeah. Uh, Vulcan... Uh, Vulcan Raven. Raven. Psycho Mantis. Psycho Mantis. I don't know. There's There was a, like a female one. Maybe it's more fun if I don't remind you. Okay. Yeah. But how many total were there? Six, I think, maybe. Oh, six, including? Oh, I think. Oh, so we only have like two, or we haven't seen two of them. But we haven't no. fought Psychomantis. I think yet. it's six. I don't remember. Okay. Exactly. <gasps> cool. But we'll see. Big and Dingy's here. What's Big up, Big Dingy? Big Dingy, hello. How are you doing? And yeah, family traditions. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. What a tradition, Raptor. Yeah. Uh, Blossoms says, Anthony, you said you have the physical games, but then you use them on other hardware, right? Does that have a virtual memory? So, mm. we're still playing on a legit PlayStation 1. Mm. So just, just that instead of a uh, CD drive... It's replaced with an optical drive emulator mm. that um, uses micro SD. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So it's still running the game legit. It's just instead of the game disc, mm-hmm. it's a micro SD with an image of the game. Mm. Um, and then so on the PlayStation 1, you use the regular controller, the regular hookups, and um, regular memory card. Nice. There's that. Yeah, Shallow Hal. <laughs> oh. I wonder yeah. if that game... <laughs> or that, that the movie holds up. Oh, no. I mean, maybe. it's probably still entertaining to watch, but I don't think something like yeah, that would not. fly. Well, actually, we're watching yeah, it. I don't, I don't <laughs> we're going to watch know. it. I'm thinking about the message, but the, you know, the type of comedy. It's one of those things. It's a product, product of its time. Product sort of. of its time. You're totally yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but imagine Hal Emmerich as a, or Jack Black playing a Hal Emmerich. Blossom. <laughs> Oh, what? Everything is uh, good. Don't worry about it. 
Um, PS1 Digital, yeah. <laughs> Lou, that was like one of my first craziest high-level mods to mm. do on my own. Yeah. Modifications for a console. Yeah. It was really intense. But, oh, yeah? And it worked. And it worked! And it first worked. try? And it's still working. Let's go! Nice. And it hasn't broken down. Um, I got the best story for Metal Gear Solid. Oh, Paradox, like you mean like a, yeah, like a personal story? Because that sounds really interesting. I don't know if it's spoilery, but maybe... If if you can share it, would love to hear it. Yeah, sure. Now how would get canceled? I, I was so. probably thinking that too. I just I don't remember it exactly. <laughs> I do remember in that movie. Oh, this is total tangent. Sure. It was That's like fine. one of the characters had this like fixation on women's feet, and like I think this is this movie, and like the I think so. the 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 toe next to the big toe. I like think, something is that is I that think, is that a thing? Like I don't, I, I never, don't I, I never like followed up. Like oh, is that a thing that people actually think about? But I do think about that sometimes because of that movie. Not 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 like. I think that was that movie. <laughs> not that I'm thinking about women's feet all the time. I'm just, I'm I'm just commenting. You brought it up. I know. Maybe I you should. You brought it up. Anyway. Where's Clayton? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> hmm. Paradox had the game. Not the case. Oh. It was just before internet became big. Uh -huh. So me and my brother called Funko Land to have the person <gasps> look at the back of the case for the Merrill Codex. Oh. Funko Land was what GameStop was. Yeah, I'm I'm very familiar with Funko Land. Paradox. I didn't know that about Funko, to to Land. Funko Land. But did you did you connect the dots? Like they keep saying the back of the CD, back of the CD. Do they mean like the back of the box, or did you hear from like a friend I imagine or something? that conversation with your brother. No, you call him. Yeah. No, that's stupid. Yeah. But it's got to be on the back of the box. Yeah. You call him. No, you call him. Uh, hi. Um, I'm in this. I'm playing this game called Metal Gear Solid, and we gotta call. There's Meryl. a character called Snake, and we're trying to get in touch with Meryl. I bet you the store knew. You think so? We we got you. We got yeah. you. They just had the code the the codec <laughs> number on a, a post it note. <laughs> That's awesome. That is super Oh, awesome. you figured it out and instantly called. No crap. Oh, okay, hey, okay, okay. Nice. Oh, the girl was clueless. Okay, yeah. Well, I mean, I imagine they were at least <laughs> able to help, right? Yeah. That is that is so fun. <laughs> no, I didn't <laughs> no. You brought it up. You brought I, it up. I brought it up, but I didn't say I have a fixation. It's just something I think about because of that movie. <laughs> All right, let's get into the game. Let's get into the game. We're moving along. Okay. Metal Gear Solid. Let's get into it. Okay. Here we Oops. are. Oh, I gotta switch. There we go. We're good. We're good. All right. Again, I, it's been a couple weeks, so yeah. please excuse the first couple of deaths as I relearn the controls yet again. All right. Do you want to read it, or do you want me to read it? I'll read it. Okay. Mission log. Dude, the art is so good. The art is good. Oh, did they have that in the back before? Or do they update it because we've seen Gray Fox at this point? They update it. <gasps> Isn't that great? Oh, cool. It's so good. Snake successfully res rescues Otacon, but is shocked by the fact that the ninja he drove away is his war buddy, Gray Fox. Discovering that Metal Gear has been developed against his will as a nuclear missile launching walking tank. Otacon offers to help Snake. Snake tries to meet up with Meryl to get the detonation code emergency override key that she <laughs> has. According to Otacon, Meryl is disguised as an enemy soldier. What do you I remember forgot about, about that. that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Meryl is disguised. Mm -hmm. Um. So are we, are we going to have to try to identify her? Yes. So we're going to have to look at their butts, right? Did they say something about butts? Or am I just remembering butts? Audrey has butts on the mind. Oh, wait, I think I remember. They showed they showed like a flashback to Meryl's butt or something, right? Like, mm. Or you just oh, were oh, having no, flashbacks. No, 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 no. They said, look for a soldier. No, am I making this up? No, she, he said uh, okay. <laughs> she had a cute certain way of walking. Or did he, did Otacon explicitly say she had a cute butt or something? Oh like that? my God. Yeah, I'm this pretty game sure this is, a is horny. Uh, <laughs> Going first person. Feet butts? What's next? <laughs> that's, I'm pretty sure that's a PlayStation. Huh? I mean, hey, d don't yuck someone's yum. Okay. Not saying that's my my thing. I'm just saying. Okay. 
<laughs> and Zoroctor with the Zoroctor. follow. Thank you so Thank much, you. Zoroctor. Mini dance party for you. Celebration dance party. Let's do some more refreshing New by year, giving everyone same a call. dance moves. <laughs> Wait, do we have Otacon's codec? He gave it to us. Uh oh. Can someone check? I can check. Okay. Be careful about spoilers. Okay, I'm just gonna Google Otacon. Maybe Metal Gear Solid One. Frequent? Is it? Is it what? Is it? Codec? Codec. Oh, codec. Fre oh, frequency works too. Oh, codec MGS1. That is exactly what I typed in. Okay. Oh, codec frequencies, plural. Okay, so I'm going to try to go straight to the. Oh, no, Big Dingy's got it for us. Oh, okay, okay, oh, okay, 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 cool. 14112, okay. Thank Audrey's you. Audrey's about Dingy. to go into freaking minefield. I don't spoilers. know. I was going to be very careful, maybe like squint a little bit so I didn't Thank accidentally you, Big Dingy. Dingy. Something. Thank you, Big Dingy. Yeah, <laughs> Zeroctum. Zeroctum, you're very welcome. Snake, the Warhead storage building that you're in has one floor above ground and two floors below ground. Why don't you search there too? Okay, so we're looking in this building. <laughs> awesome. Well, Audrey did say she likes Tarantino. <laughs> yeah. I, you know, every time I watch a Tarantino film, I look for <laughs> I, It's when, that? When there's a, 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 a foot shot in a Tarantino film, I'm like, there it is. Do you know the other thing? Hands? Food. Oh, food. A lot of emphasis on food and making it look particularly delicious. Oh, I like that. Do you remember the uh, the pastry in Inglorious Bastards with the cream, the whipped cream? Oh, wait for yeah, the yeah. cream? A lot of food. I don't okay. remember it exactly what it looks like, but I do remember that moment. All right, we're just going to check in with everyone. Well, it looks like you've rescued Emmerich for the time being. Yeah, with that stealth camouflage, he should be able to hide safely. Gray Fox, I can't believe it. But the real problem is your niece. The way the codec got cut off. Oh, that's right. Warhead. Yeah. Something must have happened to her. You're worried about Mara? This Not woman exactly. is sketchy. Just that she's holding the detonation she is code the over true IGs. villain, I think. They're our last chance of stopping that nuclear Not launch. actually. You're a cold man. Your mission is more important than the life of your companions. This is war. What? Survival is the name of the game. Sometimes you have to be cold to survive. Yes, but... Snake, either way, I want you to find Meryl as soon as possible. I understand. Dude, Jennifer Hale. Jennifer Hale. Oh, if you did hand-to-hand -hand with Gray Fox, the fight is a lot easier. I think we did. Oh. I think we did do um hand-to-hand. -hand. Oh, because if you shoot, doesn't doesn't he just, like, deflect he everything? Deflects and dodges, I think. Yeah, yeah. People who have been through war and survived... Okay, we heard this one. kind of... Yeah. <laughs> Lou. <laughs> 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 no response from Meryl, as expected. Ah, right. No response. Natasha? Otacon said that now it's possible to design and test new types of nuclear weapons in a virtual simulation. I think we talked to her at the end of the last stream. Oh, right, oh, oh, right, right. Yeah. Yes, it is true. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yep. Okay. And then let's just do one quick with melee. What is it, Snake? Oh. Be careful, Snake. Okay, very good. Uh, so we're just checking the other floors. Yeah, Anthony's memory always amazes me. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I, I didn't recaps? say that. Big Dingy said that. For the recaps? Yeah, uh, yeah. I was wondering what, what, uh, what made you say that. Big mm. Dingy. I feel like, to an extent, Anthony slash Audrey look up past VODs to refresh. Not 100% on that, though. Yeah. When um, well, we have time. When we have time. I don't know if you did um, before today, but also Anthony does have generally a good memory when it comes to video game good. plot. <laughs> and doing it like a conversation with you yeah. is easier than if I was just trying to recall it on my own. Mm, right? Yeah. When, I, when I form stuff as a question... Or yeah. I tell you things like uh, in the form of a story. Yeah, I'm like remembering them sentences as a, at a time. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, we can fun. bounce off each other. Like, oh, I remember this. I remember the butts. Oh yeah, the butts. Oh, if you use the save call and don't save enough, she will ignore. Oh, that's that's mean. You keep calling her and saying nothing. Oh no, I like mailing. We can't ignore her. Whoa, paradox! I have not played this game in close to over ten years. I remember. Everything. It's a very memorable game. Yeah, before, before, or before ten years ago, were you playing it fairly often? Oh, the oh yeah. Do you have a gas mask? Yeah, you do. 
And we already checked all these rooms, right? Oh, yes. There's something happening. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> this game is short enough. You can remember the beat-by-beat -beat structure once you've played it. Right, right, yeah. right, right. That makes sense. Huh, yeah, you said it was pretty short. Relative to all the games we've been freaking playing. Yeah. Relative to other PS1 games? I don't know. It's hard to say. I don't know the average. Me neither. But let's not talk too specific about how much game there is left. Okay, okay. Yeah, because right. that could indicate certain things. Yeah, for Audrey. Um, so we're just going to check the other floors. Do we recall... I mean, again, everyone, we're playing on an easier difficulty, and Audrey does have a spoiler-free walkthrough. I do. Just to facilitate a smooth story It has, story like, no experience. details in it, except for where to go. Um, you want me to look what's going on here? Sure. So we, let's see, we let's see. Find the disguised guard with a different walk. On what, um, does it say what um, floor? Sorry. Return to the elevator and take it to B1. Arthur says might be 15 for me, 15 years. When did this game come out? Mm. 1998, maybe? I'm not sure. 90. Oh, yeah, 98. Wow. Uh, Big Dingy says his ability to connect everything plot-wise, like um, how he did in 10, Final mm. Fantasy 10. He'll skillfully lead Audrey in a story recap without spoiling. Ah, Big Dingy, you're right. You're right. Anthony's very good at that. And Anthony's very, um, like, careful and deliberate when it comes to spoilers and story uh, things uh, in general. Oh. That's door level five. We only have level four. Someone's coming Ooh, out. Someone's coming out. Is that the one with the funny walk? Or... Uh, that looks kind of normal. Sorry, we have to go first person a lot. Mm -mm. Apologies for the motion sickness. No, no problem. Uh, it, the story recap thing is probably a skill we've both just developed through streaming in the last year and a half. I mean, right? I don't know if I've developed that skill, but uh, you certainly have. <laughs> um, PS1 games have interesting camera angles. Some dude made a mod of remake with OG7 camera angles. Uh oh, uh oh, <gasps> that's uh -oh. interesting. Uh oh. Careful. No Sorry. doors? Oh, they're going at the urinal? Oh, is it blurred out there? Yeah. Censored? Oh, dude. Fuck, dude. I think you touched him. I think someone said that before, like when you like yeah, accidentally you touched them. Close. I'm just choking everyone um, out. Oh, Big Dingy says, but it was the Inglorious Bastards. Bastard's reference that made me say that though. Gotcha, big team. Yeah. Games and movies. Anthony's uh, mind is definitely Fudge. wired for uh, for those mediums. Dude. Oh, we're just. Dude. Oh, what, are you gonna, what if you accidentally hurt her? Oh. Do you know which one Meryl is? Oh, what if I accidentally kill her? You're right. Okay, uh, Did you so, hear that voice? Yeah, it sounded higher pitched. No? Wait. I think this is the women's restroom. Wait. Oh! oh look at the walk, though. She, that definitely sounded like. I think a we just skipped tone. the walk. Don't move. We <laughs> skipped the whole because there's a whole separate you? room. We're supposed to sneak what around like, and look. How could you attack me like that? Yeah, we're supposed to like follow her. Okay, okay. Been able to sneak up on the legendary solid oh my goodness! And we Your fumbled mail. into that one. There's no way you could pass for a man for long. What do you mean? Oh, this is our first time hey, actually seeing her. her. I had no idea you were so feminine. This is no time to try and hit on me, Snake. <laughs> wow. We really fumbled into that. We we're supposed to walk around a room tracking her. <laughs> when I joined up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my interest in men. <gasps> Same smart mouth. You're Meryl, all right. Are you hurt? Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off dressed like one of them. I got tired of disguising myself. The truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. What's that mark? Huh? Oh, this? It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. 
I was a fan of Foxhound way back. <laughs> like you and my uncle were in it. None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. <laughs> That's kind of cringe, Meryl. All the Meryl. heroes I know are either <laughs> dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I'm just a man who's good at what he does. Killing. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. Oh. The only winners in war are the people. That's right, and you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone but myself. I've got no purpose in life, no ultimate goal. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop? Is it the same with all great soldiers throughout history? Why didn't you contact me? My codec was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? How did you recognize me in disguise? <laughs> I never forget a lady. Oh my so, god! you like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. <laughs> no! First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? On the battlefield, you never think oh about what's next. <laughs> this game. So Snake, how are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear or... We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? Card keys? You mean this? Where are the others? There should be three keys. This is all I've got. Where could the other two be? I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down. I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. Whoa. I don't like to <laughs> <laughs> Got it. I'll be careful. You know, I don't use makeup the way other women do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. I always dreamed of becoming a soldier. But I was wrong. It wasn't really my dream. My father. He was killed in action when I was younger. You wanted to follow in your father's footsteps? Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. So are you a soldier yet? I thought I was until today, but now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself, afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not going to lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am, what I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Take a good look. You won't get another chance for a while. You should wash your face, too, while you're at it. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. If you lose, you're worm food. Yeah. Is that FAMAS functional? FAMAS? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where did you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol, too, but I chose this. Huh. So I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that gun a little big for a girl? Don't worry, I can handle it. <laughs> Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. <laughs> if we're gonna go to the north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the commander's room is security level five. It's the door we saw to the north. It was inside the pocket of the uniform I was wearing. Looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. <laughs> A lot of stuff happening. Okay, let's go. I know this place better than you. I'll be point man. Follow me. Okay. What do you think? Let's catch up real quick. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Um, yeah, Paradox confirms 1998 was the gotcha, release date. Yeah. Thank you. Um, yeah, sneak up on? Well. Yeah, we fumbled into that. Yeah, well, well. Oh, oh. Oh, if you are quick enough, she will not have enough time to put on pants? What the heck, Paradox? Is that really? real? If we just run in there? 
<laughs> oh my god hey kojiro what's up kojiro what's up the tension <laughs> definitely she's trying to give my boy the i'm not like other girls story yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know i did think that but she's actually not like other girls yeah. she she went, endured psychotherapy to yeah. you know like it's like a reverse of con- like uh what is it like conversion uh straight conversion therapy oh yeah, yeah. almost like just trying to make you not attract or sexually attracted to anything anyone wow kojiro i had no idea that's funny oh my gosh that is funny sounds like a kojima Should thing I to do the ration? man this game is super horny i'm gonna use a ration then i'm gonna save how about that uh, let's call a mailing sounds good it's a good thing you hooked up with meryl you should have seen the colonel. He doesn't like to let it show because he's the boss, but he was so happy he could Aww, barely contain himself. I forgot they can see I'm everything. Glad to hear that. <laughs> should we call everyone else in too? Hey, uh, stop talking about my niece's butt, please. <laughs> yeah, let's check. Let's check. You're making me very uncomfortable. <laughs> colonel, your niece is fine. <laughs> Thank goodness. Okay. <laughs> can't relax. Not yet. I know. Snake. Praising. She's quite a woman. As commander of this operation, oh! I can't ask you to watch after Meryl, but duty first? Maybe I was wrong. Sending my own flesh and blood to war. She understands about duty. I know she does. But what I want to know is, what was the real purpose of this military exercise? I don't know. Like I said, I'm nothing more than a middleman. Is this transmission being monitored by the military? Of course. I get it. All the world's a stage, and we're mm. merely players, right? Yes, but even players can influence the play. I just hope we can prevent it from having a bad ending. So yeah, just a reminder that uh, Roy Campbell's not really in charge of anything. He's no. brought in here as kind of like a handler for Snake. Yeah. Because Snake would only really work with Roy. At some point, the government's going to step in, and they're going to be like, we're done with you. We don't need your services anymore. I you don't love, even I'm ready really, for these predictions, Audrey. Keep, keep you don't even coming. really work for us, Campbell. And then they're going to kill him. No, I don't know. You managed to link up with Meryl. Good. So now you This guy kind of this guy is kind of an enigma. Code. <laughs> All these characters are. But this one in particular cuz did did he just kind of get our he just called us or something, right? Uh, he heard about the operation from Campbell and yeah. thought we could use some help. Because he helped us with survival training in the past. That's yeah. our relationship. And then what? So he's just kind of like our tips guy. Tips guy. Same thing with Natasha okay. about like weapons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess it's just maybe because we haven't seen them face to face. I feel like, you know, I don't have the, I don't feel that you connection. Oh. Oh. Thank God Meryl's okay. Dude. She's a tough one, all right. Although when you look at her, it's hard to imagine how tough. <laughs> it must be the walk. Oh my God. <laughs> anyway, I'm glad she's okay. I also got a key from her. I think I can use it to stop them from launching a nuke. Get to Metal Gear's underground maintenance base. That's where the detonation code input system is. Uh, the voice for Otacon is good. Yeah. really good. I like, it I like really Otacon's matches. Voice. Great great character yeah it's not like overly like nerdy yeah scientist engineer like weeaboo like nasally kind of thing you might expect from a character like yeah. that it's pretty clear and nice. makes me think yeah. of shaggy a little oh a little bit yeah uh kojiro yeah totally fine if it has no story spoilers that's fine mm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. big dingy i like how everyone's so responsive my friends don't even text me yeah. like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're That's all up the to next, date, too. The next Metal Gear game is uh, all through text message, and it just says left on red or <laughs> yeah. seen, seen at this time. <laughs> yeah, Kojiro, um, Paradox mentioned that earlier. I don't know if I want to do that, Ah, though. yeah. And Nao's here. Hello. Hey, How are you doing, Nao? Nao? What's up? Strange. There's no um, yeah, fine, you say, Blossom. Oh, what happened to the Your music? niece is fine, if I'll you know what I mean. Out. No Make guards, sure no music. Ready, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, wait. Cardboard box B. 
Level six. There's all these goodies. Wait, where did everyone go? Pan. Why is there no one here? We don't know. That's what we're wondering. Right oh. Now. Night vision goggle. Okay. There's some goodies here. So there were like, there's supposed to be guards in here patrolling. And we we're supposed to walk around, sneaking around, going into first person to see which one has the weird walk. Yeah. But we kind of just fumbled into the correct person. Or you, f you like. I'm pretty sure I threw her on the ground. You right? did throw her, and then she kind of, you kind of heard her voice. Yeah. Just a bunch of ammo and stuff. But what happens if you kill her? I wonder. GG, probably. Yeah. King in the north. Thank you so much thank for, the you for the follow. We really appreciate, appreciate it. it. Here's a little mini dance party for you. Dance party. And the triple hydrate. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the triple hydrate. Time for some water. I'm going to save it again after we picked up all that stuff. Oh, okay. Sounds good. Um, Neo's doing well. That's good to hear. No guards, no music, just Marilyn, her bootylicious <laughs> walk. Kojiro. <laughs> oh, my Oops, God. Oops, dang it. Yeah, it must be nap time. Everyone is taking a nap. Seems Snake. like it. Go with me. Or on lunch, maybe. Maybe. What can I do for you, Snake? Let me just save it again. Oh, I see Audrey's trying new dances after that comment Oops. on Monday. You know. I accidentally skipped this if you want to read it. Uh, sure, yeah. Mei Ling, how did you get into this line of work? Oh. oh. The truth is, I always wanted to become a fighter pilot. I fell in love with jets watching them in the movies. You'd be surprised how many people say the same thing. But I didn't want to kill people. That's when I heard that the U.S. Air Force needed people to do BDAs, battle damage assessments. Mm. Those are the guys whose job it is to confirm how successful a bombing run was. Yeah, so I started to do research into aerial photography and air intelligence. I made it my air, my major. But there are no pilots who do who only do BDAs. Mm. That's right. But by the time I learned that, I was already an expert in my field. Mm. I hope she gets the the chance to shine like that, like she gets to pilot a plane for us or something, and we're like escaping some we'll see. somebody. We yeah. will see. <laughs> yeah, Audrey I appreciate to... these predictions, Audrey. Yeah, okay. Audrey, I'm not really predicting. I'm just saying, Hoping. oh, it'd be cool if this happened, you know. <laughs> um, new dance moves? Ish. Ish. I wouldn't say I'm practicing. We have the level five key now for this door. Okay. They said that the overland route is covered with in glaciers, We had, but there's like a hidden path? underground path okay. in this office. This is like, like a that. nice looking hallway with like, <laughs> it seems like. Hotel, conference room, lighting. Oh. Yeah, this is a nice space relative to the rest of this. I don't know, like fortress. My head. Oh. What's wrong? Don't come here, Snake. What? Are you okay? She didn't have a heart attack. Oh. What happened? I'm fine. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Snake, come on. That walk is different. That walk is different. On, Mr. Foxhound. Oh, never mind. The commander is waiting. The commander? Mr. Foxhound. What? Oh, wait, huh? What happens? What? Is she gonna shoot you right now? Whoa, what, did you trigger something? I think so. <gasps> oh! Oh my god. 
Hey, let's take this call in the middle of this fight. Not herself. Don't use your oh no. Uh huh. Yes. Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. How are Don't we immune to it? Try to knock her out. How are we immune to the um thing? Oh, you, can you shoot him in the back? I'm trying to knock her out. Oh, I see. I see. This is the best fight of the game. Paradox says. There. Okay. Oh, nice. She's knocked out. Okay. <sighs> Useless woman. Up to camouflage, huh? I hope that's not your only trick. You. You doubt my power. Now I will show you why I am the most powerful practitioner of psychokinesis and telepathy. Why? Yeah. What was this thing? He was able to get into people's heads. Hmm. It's useless, I told you. I can read your every thought. I can read your every Now, let me read your mind. No, perhaps I should say your past. Ooh. You're a careless man, aren't you? Huh? However, you are a skilled warrior. You like brute force. I've meleeed a lot of people, he's saying. Oh, he's he's reading into what has happened in the game so far. Yeah, he's talking about our game over too. I think. <gasps> really? You are playing on a PlayStation One. <gasps> what? What? No, really? What? I'm guessing he's reading up the memory card. <laughs> Dance, dance revolution. <laughs> wow. That's scary. You still don't believe me? I will show you my psychokinetic power. Put your controller on the floor. <gasps> Put it down as flat as you can. Me? Why me? Put it down? Okay, I'm putting it down. On your mouse pad. I put it down. Really? This is so funny. Yes! It's moving! He's doing it! What do you think now? Okay. Can you feel the power now? A demonstration is all That's so funny! <laughs> so, I put in the work and I loaded all the possible save files for games. Oh, that, that he would re me? react to onto the save, wow. onto the memory card. It was like only four different games. Hmm, so you seem to subscribe a lot of, of OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it was like four different games and I just loaded save files for those games. Oh! Onto the memory card. Oh my god, that's <laughs> so cool! In the GameCube remake, it responds to different games, some Nintendo games. Oh, really? Oh, oh, you uh, like Mario. Because of uh, GameCube? Because of GameCube, oh, yeah. Oh yeah. my god! Kojiro, I just downloaded save files and transferred them to my memory card. That is... In preparation. So fun. Oh, my God. Does this game use much vibration outside of the, at this moment? Yeah. Uh, all over the place. Um, yeah, <sighs> I, I wasn't sure what Azure Dreams are, but I, I, I kind of guessed that it was something like mm -hmm. related to like the memory card. It's like four different Konami games. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Okay, here we go. Um, do oh. you have... Oh, the video <gasps> went out. Why does it say it out? Wait, was that part of the fight? Yeah. What? That scared me. I was like, do I need to change the scene right now? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's, it's supposed to be like video, but it doesn't say video. Oh, Duck Bunker Deluxe Thank with you so much. Raid. Oh, we're in the middle of Psycho Mantis. Wait. Audrey will dance. Dance party for the raid. Hello. Cool So, Thanks for being here. Oh my god. 
Wait. Okay, so there's gonna this this game this fight has shenanigans. I'm pretty sure. Um. Oh, Astro Dreams is a roguelike. Oh, wow. Ooh, that I, I don't know anything about the game. This is the fight you were talking about, Anthony. Uh, Paradox says. Yeah, uh, Lou, I, I know. I just don't want to do that yet. Lou asks what's OnlyFans. Lou, just you know, don't worry about it. There's just, you know, bands you plug into the wall, cools down the room. Um, yes, Cadaver. I'm so glad I got to see Psycho Mantis. We are in Psycho Mantis. Oh, my God. Um, I don't know if you were here to see right before this the memory card thing. Well, are you Love are it. you doing something here? This no, is scary. No. <laughs> yeah. What is happening? Oh, I forgot my raid message. That's okay, Doug. Um, and Dan Lab is here as well. Hello. Thank you so much. Sorry, I can't keep up with chat. All good. I'll keep up with chat. Quack Splat. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh, Cadaver was here for that part. Yeah, they were. Um, Psycho Mantis was reading off our memory card and called out to uh, As Your Dreams and Sweet Quidden and um, and um, our only fans. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, what, was that? what else? Other Konami games. Oh, yeah. Castlevania also. Should I just skip to the cheese right now? Um, All right. do they, is there Let's like a it. hint? Because I think that I know about this one. Yeah, this is what, what I is accidentally kind of referenced earlier. Yeah. Does the game reference it? I'm just gonna do it for the sake of speed. But okay. Why? What does this? But why? What is the context for what's about to happen? Because he can read our mind. But he can't read. Player two. Player mind. two. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm moving really? the controller over to controller uh, port two. <laughs> oh, Campbell will eventually tell you to do it. Gotcha. Oh. Okay. Like if you game over. Wait. Oh. Oh. I see. I see. Psycho is a son of a gun. That he is. Uh, <laughs> have you played any other uh, Metal Gear Solid games? Oh, Marth is here. Hey, Marth. Hey, um, Marth. What's up? Anthony has, I think, played all the mainline uh, Metal Gear. I have not Ge played Metal oh, Gear Solid 5. Uh, except 5. Um, I watched my brother play 4 um, years ago, and that was the only one I'd seen like someone play. I've never played any myself, um, and I completely lacked the context for that game, so I don't really know... I, I mean, I was it was an amazing, it, like, from what I saw, it was really interesting uh, and beautiful, but I lacked a lot of context, and so I've read things here and there about this game, um, but I, I don't know everything. Um, Maybe you listen to him, too. What did he say? Uh, what he might say. Oh, okay. I'll listen. So, so he, he can no longer read you? Hear that? I didn't hear it. I can't read you. Oh, I can't read you? <gasps> yeah, she's the hell out of it, Paradox says. Oh, heat or night vision goggles will help here, Paradox oh. says. Oh. Uh, okay. And Rydrake with the raid. Hello, Rydrake. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you very for much for the raid. Thank you so much I'll just keep my rate. rations out. I think we're doing okay. We are doing okay. So we're in the middle of the Psycho Mantis fight. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Um. Oh, gosh. This is. Stop! Man. Oh, I forgot what to do here. Don't tell us though. Oh God. No. Okay. Oh, that was it. Yeah. The same thing no. over and over. It cannot be. <laughs> oh, blossom! I was afraid my memory card question earlier would be a little too leading. I tried hard to word it that in a way. Yeah, but I knew what you were talking about. Oh, I saw you ask that, but I wasn't yeah. sure. I thought you were just genuinely curious, blossom. Well done. I I was totally. Um, I was I was not Ouch. led on at all. When he turns invisible for oh the night vision goggles. 
Oh, I don't think it's challenging enough that I need to do that. But I appreciate the tip. Um, oh, yeah, Right Drake, I had to. You're playing Metal Gear Solid and on Mantis. Nice. Thank you so much, Right Drake. Yeah, this. <gasps> yeah, someone said this was the. Oops. Best. Uh, best. Their favorite fight in the game. Pretty special. <sighs> Colonel, your niece is going to be okay. <laughs> yeah. He just flipped her like. I'm going to move times. it over to controller part one. Oh, okay. Now that Mantis is beaten. Or after this, I don't want to okay. ruin it. should wear off, right, Naomi? Yes. But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? What? For Campbell's sake, or maybe it's because you like her. I don't want to see any woman die right in front of me. Oh, really? Since when did anybody's death bother you so much? Naomi, it's true that Snake has killed a lot of people, but that doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Colonel. She's right. Wait, isn't Naomi the one who... W was Naomi... Oh, sorry. Oh, hold on. Controller <laughs> port. I wasn't able to read the future. A strong oh man doesn't God. need to read the future. He makes his own. So what if he quoted Castlevania right now? Telling us, past the communication towers and use the tower's walkway. Why are you telling oh. me this? I can read people's minds. In my lifetime, I have read the past, presents, and futures of thousands upon thousands of <gasps> men and women. Aww. Oh, gross. <gasps> Meryl! And each mind that I peered into was stuffed with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed. It was enough to make me sick. Every living thing on this planet exists to mindlessly pass on their DNA. We're designed that way. And that's why there is war. But you, you are different. You're the same as us. Oh. We have no past, no future. We live in the moment. That's our only purpose. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment oh. we're thrown into this world, we're fated to bring each other nothing but pain and misery. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. I saw nothing but disgust and hatred for me in his heart. My mother died in childbirth. Mm. And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. That's when my future disappeared. I lost my past as well. When I came to, the village was engulfed in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same trauma. <laughs> These characters are so crazy. We are truly the same, you and I. Is a more interesting place with people like you in it. I never agreed with the boss's revolution. His dreams of world conquest do not interest mm. me. I just wanted an excuse to kill as many people as I could. You monster. Let him talk. He doesn't have much time left. I've seen through evil. You, Snake, you're just like the boss. 
No, you're worse. Oh! Compared to you, I'm not so bad. What does he mean by that? I read her mind as well. Meryl's? I saw you there. Uh oh. You have a large place in your heart. A large place? Yes. Not cool. A large place. But I do not know if your futures lie together. I have a last request. What is it? My mask. Put it back on. Okay. Like this. Other people's thoughts force their way into my mind before I die. I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. I'll open the door for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. Let's go, Meryl. I'm sorry. Meryl? How could I let Mantis control my mind like that? If you're gonna doubt yourself, I'll leave you here. You're right. Never doubt yourself. Just let it make you stronger. Learn something from it. You're right. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Snake, can I ask you something? What? About what Mantis said. I was just wondering. What? What's the problem now? Oh, no, nothing. Whoa! So, tell me, Snake. What's your name? Your real name? A name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? Old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? No, but I was raised by many people. Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Wait, Other did Mantis say that? complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. You're a sad, lonely man. Come on. Let's go. Hey, Prince Leo, what's up? Snake! Yeah, this game absolutely ahead of its time. They actually make you feel kind of bad for him somehow. Yeah, that's really good. Oh, you, <laughs> we got to put the... Ah, uh, that's funny. They do. And yeah, hi, Prince Leo. How are you doing? They do make you feel bad, but... I don't know. Kind of. A little. And a little's a lot when it comes to, like, humanizing villains. Yeah. He's still terrible. But... It's bad. I, I personally prefer that over like just evil for evil's sake. Yeah. Look at the statues, dude. Oh. So he was he had abilities since he was young, not yeah. because of the soldier uh, mo gene modification stuff. No, I don't think these uh, foxhound members are necessarily like gene therapy dudes. That's just the soldiers. That's just the the genome soldiers. The grunts that were fighting everywhere, right? Those are genome soldiers. No, but these are too, right? Actually, I don't I know. I thought everyone is. I thought they've been talking about like gene therapy, you know, genome soldiers. I thought that was all just the regular grunts, the regular soldiers, not the foxhound members. No, I thought the foxhound, the foxhound members, members are like special for sure. I think they said, didn't okay, they? Then. Well, that's that's. I thought they did, and that's why I thought maybe they wanted to take back. Big Boss's body because I, I I theorized before I was like oh maybe they want to you know st take Big Boss's body to stop you know just all this you know, super soldier stuff because mm. they know what it's what it's like being on that side or something like that. the motivation that has been made clear to us in like 
if you don't read into it, it's just they've said they they just want to use it to make even better soldiers. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I know that is the surface. I was just saying, oh, wouldn't it be like a twist if it was like, sure. oh, really? They want to stop yeah. it. Yeah. Keep the predictions coming. And Crudy's here. Hello, Crudy. How are you doing? Missed the cool part. What's it was up, Crudy? pretty cool. Um, you can always check the VOD. Wolf dogs. Half wolf, half husky. How do you know so much? I ride dog sleds. I'm a musher. What? <laughs> I'll take point. Snake, you follow me. Kind of looks like Volda from Soul Calibur. I'm gonna yeah, the one that's up. like... Remember, someone brought that up before for some other character. Oh. Ah! All right. Ah, Voldo. Oh, 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 oh. Um, Blossom says, yeah, I think a little is better than humanizing a villain so much you think this person is better than the protagonist. Mm -hmm. Although that gray versus gray can obviously work. I guess what I mean is if it's white versus gray, if that makes sense. Yeah, that does make sense. I get that. I get that. I have the night vision. There we go. Oh. Um... Hey, Dirge Inferno, how are hey, you doing? Dirge. Oh, funny coincidence, I am just about to get my girlfriend into this game series. Nice. Starting with Metal Gear Solid, or are you starting with Metal Gear 1? Because um, we decided to just jump straight into Metal Gear Solid 1, and we read, or the, the game included this kind of recap about Metal Gear 1 and 2 that we, that we read. Which was really well written. Yeah, it was pretty comprehensive. Or I I'd never played the game myself, so I don't actually know, but it seemed pretty good. I mean, Snake also killed a lot of people. Who decides what's good or bad? Yeah, is intention enough? Um, even then, Snake's intention. I think it's that's just... That's what, yeah, that's what um, Psychomantis was saying. Like, no, you're worse. Yeah. Well, I, I wonder what, what he meant by that. Oh. Because Snake has killed so many, or because he read something more into his, like, I don't know, his intention. Okay, okay. stop. I'm just trying to go here. Uh, yeah, Leo, I never played the NES Metal Gears. I don't think you have either, right? No, I have not. Yeah, Anthony only played the Metal Gear Solid games, excluding five. Um, and yeah, I haven't either. F. Uh, Kojiro says, oh, Metal Gear on the NES is pretty tough. Never beaten it. Is it the same kind of, um, gameplay for the most part? Like, this kind of stealth, stealth thing? Action, yeah. Stealth action, Okay. A tactical... Oh, puppy. Stealth espionage game? Yeah. Yeah, Leo started with Solid as well. Gotcha. See that? Oh! They're loyal... Oh. What's wrong? I thought you were good. They like Meryl? I think they like Meryl. Aww. I like how they have little hearts yeah. floating. That's so you know. <laughs> yeah, so we know for sure. Um, <sighs> Kojito rented Metal Gear once or twice, and I've read the World oh, of Power Books. World of Power Books. So this is the walkway to the other building? Okay. I think. And what's waiting for us over here? This place is mine. Oh, okay. I'll take point again. Stay back, okay? But the radar is working. And since we can't use the mine detector either... Leave it to me. All right. We gotta memorize this. Oh. Well, how does she know? She said, leave it to me. Yeah, but the radar wasn't working. Oh, does it? Is it going to keep the footsteps? Not forever. Is it some sort of shape? Oh God. So what do you think? Pretty good, huh? How did you know where the mines were? It sounds weird, but when Mantis dove into oh. my mind, I was able to see where the mines were placed. Are you impressed? Well, a little bit. Only a little? <gasps> oh my God. I thought There's no walk. you overstepped. 
Ooh. I thought I did too. What happens if you step on a mine? I don't Does know. it alert people or do you just take damage? I don't know. Oh, that was easily done. Uh oh. Meryl. What is it? What is it? Meryl, get down! Oh! <gasps> Meryl's dead! Oh my god! Oh, through the... Through her fan tattoo. Snake. Leave me and run. Meryl. What the heck? I guess... I am a rookie after all. Don't worry, Meryl. It's me they want. Even I know that. Dude, this, like... The song. It's the oldest trick in the book. Ah, uh, trying to the bait out Snake. Using me for yeah. bait to lure you out. Damn. Shoot me, Snake. Whoa. My gun. I can't reach it by myself. Don't move. I promised. I wouldn't slow you down. I. 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 I can still help. I want to help you. Quiet down. Save your strength. I was a fool. I wanted to be a soldier. But war is ugly. There's nothing glamorous about it. Snake, please save yourself. Go on living and don't give up on people. Don't forget me. Don't give up on people. He said he doesn't care about anyone mm. other than himself. Now get out of here. Uh oh. Meryl. Damn. Snake, it's a trap. A sniper's trick to lure you out. The sniper's waiting for you to go and help Meryl so he can pick you off. Don't do it. it must be Sniper Wolf, Foxhound's best shooter. Snipers usually work in pairs, but this one's alone, huh? I know her. She can wait for ah! hours, days, or weeks. It doesn't matter to her. She's just watching and waiting for you to expose yourself. Camper. Maybe so, but Meryl can't hold out that long. Snake, can you see Wolf from where you are? There's nowhere to hide between here and the tower. She must be on the second floor of the tower. If Wolf is in the communications tower, she can see you perfectly. It's the classic sniper's position. At that distance, you won't be able to hit her with a standard weapon either. You'll need a sniper rifle. Colonel, take it easy. I'm gonna save Meryl, no matter what it takes. Okay. Thanks. What's wrong, Naomi? Nothing. I'm just surprised you're willing to sacrifice yourself. You got the genes of a soldier, not a savior. You trying to say that Whoa. I'm only interested in saving my own skin? I wouldn't go that far, but... I don't know what the hell my genes look like, and I don't care. I operate on instinct. Like an animal? I'm going to save Meryl. I don't need an excuse. Naomi is the cold one here, I and feel I'm like. I'm not doing it for someone else, either. I'm going to save Meryl for myself. Colonel, don't worry. Snake, thanks. I understand. I'm sorry. Yeah. She's just recognizing that he's, like, different than she thought. Yeah. Um, World of Power were a series of short stories that were based on mini novelization of NES games. Oh, oh. we're basically mini novelizations. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, I think I remember what we need to do, but let's just do some codec calls just in case the game. Okay, will tell yeah, Smooth us. Brain Academy. <laughs> Campbell said we need a sniper. Range and shoot at her with a sniper rifle. Yeah, but where can I find a sniper rifle? I can't ask Meryl. What about Doctor Emrick? He's been on the base for a while. He might know. Otacon, have you ever seen a sniper rifle anywhere Love the on this base? Howling. A sniper mm -hmm. rifle? Meryl's been shot by an extremely good sniper. Sniper? A high quality sniper rifle is the only way I can fight back. I uh, I saw a PSG one in the armory in the second floor basement of the tank hangar. The second floor basement of the tank hangar? I have to go all the way back there? Well, yeah. 
What's wrong with you, Otacon? What? Uh, nothing. Oh no, he's he's being held up or something. Someone's got Otacon and they, they're trying to lure him back. <sighs> well, these predictions from Audrey. I don't know. So we gotta go to that same armory room, if you remember. Wait, we couldn't shoot? No, no, not that one. Even uh, farther back. Oh, wow. But it's good. It's because we have a higher level um, key card now. Ah, uh, gotcha. Um, yeah, Leo, tense part. I remember it all too well. It was. T it is tense. Uh, that's where the 10-year-old Cootie Death. learned about sniper tricks. Sniper tricks, huh? Um, did, uh, Naomi Hunter, did she say she was involved with the Gray Fox experiments? Or was that her father? Or, uh, how did she know about that? She seemed to brush it off or gave, like, a, a dot, dot, dot. Well, she's... When, she when Snake questioned her, like... Oh. How well, do you know about all this? Well, and she, she was like, dot, 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 something like that. Was she involved with the Soldier Genome Project? I think the... I think yes. But, but we don't know... I'm trying to remember exactly what the game has told us so far. I feel like she was. Yeah. I don't know. It just feels like yeah. she keeps preaching. Like, no oh, spoilers, you're, you're all. Do not confirm yeah. or deny stuff. I just feel like she keeps preaching. Refreshing to Snake, our memories. Like, yeah. oh yeah, you're you're so cold. You don't think about you know anyone but yourself. And she's out here <laughs> exp doing these like Hume experiments, trying Raptor, to yes. creating soldiers and like you know kind of um, promoting war, I guess, and all these super soldier stuff. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's just. Um, want Raptor, a tip? yes. Yes, Raptor. Please, thank you. Oh, I'm I'm probably just crazy, but the wolf howling reminds me of the first few notes of the Yu Yavin prayer. Whoa. Ooh. No, no. Oh no. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, you're right, you're right, right. That's him of the faith, right? I, I like. I remembered a different part of it. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, Otacon did say where they have to look now. So yeah, Anthony would be heading back to the... Oh, I thought you said basement two armory, no? Oh, and the other... You gotta go all the way back. Oh, really? Oh. Um, yeah, when they made you, uh, oh. made you have to go that far to get the rifle, we were all like, what the? Yeah, that's that would be frustrating. Oh, sorry. I think inside the box. Raptor is reminding me of something that okay. I totally forgot about. Okay. Oh. Can I do that here? Raptor, can I do that? Is that in this room? I totally forgot. Is um, it here? Oh. Leo says, interesting predictions, right or wrong, only time will tell. Yeah, I just, you know, like Check to pull, out, pull things out where my mind is. Uh -huh. Can you see the cardboard boxes we have? Two A heliport written on it. It's nuclear warhead storage building written on it. Oh, so is this, are these shortcuts or something? <gasps> Does this trigger like an event? Like, <gasps> is it, did that guy just go open up Oh, we're going to get... Is this a shortcut? I think so. Gosh, thank you guys for reminding me. To the heliport, huh? <gasps> oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Thank you for the reminder about this. How fun. And Viz is here. Viz, how are hey, you Viz, doing? Hey, Viz, what's up? We just uh, had a pretty incredible boss fight. Mm -hmm. We're in the red... Our memory card. Mm-hmm. And our credit history? I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But no, really, like it was like pretty fourth wall breaking. It was pretty fun. Oh, could you have found the lyrics for the Yu Yevin song? Ooh, lyrics. Oh, Ooh. fudge. I didn't know about the fast travel as a kid, but yeah, it's useful. Yeah, that's that's not something you would know to do automatically, huh? It, that's definitely a um, like a blacktop meet with your friends. Hey, did yeah. you hear about this trick? If you hide in the the right cardboard box in the transport, oh. then you get a shortcut. Um, easy how to guy. Thanks for being here. And how far through are you? We just had the psycho mantis fight, um, and then we on our way to the next building. Is a sniper a wolf? Yep, shot Merrill. Shot Merrill. And so now we're trying to find a sniper rifle so we can have yeah. a sniper fight. 
Motion um, sickness, Audrey. Careful. All good. Um, all right. Have a good night, Viz. Thanks, thanks for, for being here, in. Viz. <laughs> have a great night. Thanks, thanks for popping in and saying hi. That way you can skip the annoying door before the tank fight. Oh, is that the with the um, lasers? That door? Yes, that's right. That's right. Yeah, okay, okay. Good nice. point. That, yeah, that is a really nice shortcut. Uh, Leo says, Kojima was a master of what he does. He added so many clever ideas in this, to this game. Yes, they are clever. It's like, it's, it's clever and they're fun. And I'm not mad at it. Because you know sometimes oh, yeah, yeah. if it feels like kind of cheap where it's like um like ah oh, they, they made you like you're trying to figure out this puzzle and it was like oh what you have to look at the back of the box oh, you know kind of thing but no I, I, I am here for it I'm having fun with it yeah I agree yeah it's like quirky and wacky yeah but it doesn't really mm -hmm. it fits yeah and I it's kind of funny. It's like, I kind of want to know what other games attempted this kind of thing, but then knowing yeah. so would be a little bit of a, like, it would kind of kill the surprise. So then I also don't want to know what other games do something like this. Yeah. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God, dude. Just let me play the game. You don't want to kill this guy? That's why you have to wait till he gets back up. Oh, you don't even get your mini map when that thing is on. Yeah. Or when the oh, timer's up. Okay. Um, I'm probably doing some stuff like the hard way right now. But that's okay. Uh, supposedly Kojima has two games in development right now. Blossom says. Ooh. Fudge! Dang. There's a guy right there! <laughs> I'm just going. This is a just-go situation. Also, remember the first part of the hint might make things less annoying too, Raptor says. So Raptor's hint, as a reminder, was think inside the box near wolves and transport. Think inside the box. We'll keep that in mind. <laughs> Press the button. Uh, Leo, you sort of earn it for figuring it out. Yeah, you you do earn it. So I think maybe. Yeah. Feel free to be a little bit more direct, Raptor. Oh yeah. Oh okay. Yeah. I'm Raptor, just like doing the wrong spots. Uh, I just don't remember all, all of the paths everywhere. I can look at a, at the guide too, but I don't know if the guide knows um, or indicates the hint. Um. That poor guy, Cody. Yeah, we're just kind of constantly knocking that guy out. One, there's a guy. Um, Blossom, see, with visual novels, I want to be spoiled which ones do weird meta stuff because I never played a, a visual novel otherwise. I can think of one <laughs> kind of famous uh, visual novel recently, or not recently, but um, pretty infamous. Blossom, you probably know which one, too. I think it's this one. Oh, my goodness. Um, easy how-to guy. Do you like HP? HP. Are we talking... Harry Potter? Okay, ha that's it. Are we talking Harry Potter? Are we talking health no, points? Uh... I, that's it, as in that's a sniper. Are we talking? Oh, you nice. got a PSG one. You can use that against Sniper Wolf. Hurry up and save Meryl. Nice. Okay. Wait. It really was all the way over here. Yeah. Wait. Why? What did you think? Oh, what the heck? Sorry. What were you thinking? I was thinking, because Otacon was being all weird about it. I, you know, I thought I thought something up was up with Otacon. Oh. But it ended up actually being here. I thought it so. Fudge. Ooh. 
Those trap doors are so funny. Uh, easy how to two guys says Harry Potter. Um, I I do like Harry Potter. I'm not. I like wouldn't say I'm a fan. huge super fan. Yeah, like I don't know the you know the lore super in depth or anything. I have not read all the books. Um, but I do enjoy it, and I know there's that HBO special recently. Um, they had a reunion sort of thing. I heard it was good. Can you remind me of um, Raptor? Yeah, HP Computers Blossom. That that was gonna be my next one. Uh, yeah, Raptor, if you could remind. Um, Anthony. Health points, Crudy. Yeah, I love I love all those oh HPs, HP things. Uh, I don't know. I have this feeling that Raptor is trying to tell us there's like a even shorter shortcut, mm, but I don't, I don't okay. remember everything. Think inside the box. Think inside the box. For me, Harry Potter's first three books are good. After that, J.K. Rowling needed an editor to tell her not to make her books so long. Gotcha. I think I only read through. Sorry, the did third I did I one hundred percent grasp your hint, Raptor, or is there something else that I'm missing? Uh, that remind what exactly with? Raptor says. Uh, I think Anthony wanted a uh, more direct clarification about what to do instead of just um, uh, the kind of general hint. If if uh, you are able to share. Transport gig was second part. Oh, can you reread me, Raptor's previous message then? Oh, transport. Oh, if I only oh, oh, understood. Oh, okay. Autocon said. Oh no 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 no. Want a yeah, think inside the box, near wolves and transport. Think oh, the box? as in use the box to deal with the wolves. I vaguely remember something about that. Very vaguely. Maybe back to truck. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. I also don't know the other way out of this freaking building. <laughs> Is there another way? Oh, there was like another vent on the ground level, huh? I only ever use this one vent. Hmm. Arthur says, yeah. Gosh dang it. The only box I think inside of is Jack in the Box. Mm, midnight Tacos. That sounds good. Dude, Jack in the Box does sound pretty good right now. They have this Midnight Munchies menu. And they have a sandwich. That is like... A Thermal goggle. We missed this before. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Someone was mentioning that. Um, it's like a croissant bun with like a chicken, like a fried chicken patty, hash browns oh, in fudge. it. The noise of the ground. And it's very good. <sighs> Hide equals no C, Raptor says. <laughs> hey, thick brain. You can read? Can't relate. Thick brain. Hide equals no C, absolutely, Raptor, but then I forgot about the noise. <laughs> Mm. I was waiting for them to pass. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, Crudy, I mean, technically it's shorter running the normal way, but it's also annoying. Yeah. yeah so, yeah, I think to circumvent annoying would be yeah. more ideal. It, for, for me, anyway. Hey, Alien Zero with the hydrate. Hey, thank Alien you so Zero. Much. Thank you so much. Coffee and hydrate. the posture check. And the posture check. Thank you. How are you doing, Alien Zero? Hope you're doing well. I used to get the munchie meal after work and got the loaded nuggets. So yes. tasty. Loaded nuggets? A Jack in the Box? Have you guys had the loaded tiny tacos? I've had the lo loaded tiny tacos, but loaded nuggets, I'm going to have to look into. I'm guessing it's like the tiny tacos. It's just like nuggets with everything on it. Dude, I'm in. If you hide from wolves, they can't see you. In zero, honestly. just got home. Nice, nice. Are I we vaguely still remember that, Raptor. Um, are we still in ice skating season for... A while? Probably a at least another two, three months, right? Yeah. How long do how long do you keep it set up? Yeah. How long until curious. you pack it up? Yeah. I imagine around the holidays, it's like a big popular thing. Like, oh, families want to go ice skating and such. Controls. If you hide from the wolves, they can't see you. Yeah. No bitey bitey. Raptor says. Gotcha. Oh, God. If they were cats, though, they would try to sit on the box. In my experience. Yeah. Thick brain loaded nuggets sounds so good right now. I'm gonna have to get these loaded nuggets. Where's the camera? Oh, below. below you. Yeah, Jack in the Box. We usually go for the ultimate cheeseburger. 
Or the tacos. There we go. Okay, gosh. <sighs> and an Oreo shake. And curly fries. Their regular fries are also good. Yeah, I like Jack in the Box a lot. Mm. They were uh, how? Where do we rank them in our uh, cheer oh, maker? I don't remember. We did a fast food <laughs> cheer maker a while ago. Probably a B, maybe B. I don't remember. Oh, when they first started the Munchie Meals, Loaded Nuggets was one of the first menu items. Oh, nice. Store near me got rid of them though. Oh man, I saw. All there is to load. I wonder if I they had storage, cheese bacon yeah. bits and another sauce on them. Nice. Ooh. Oh man, so it seems like maybe not. They don't have them. Anymore. And Cereal Mate is here. Cereal Mate, hey, how cereal. are you What's doing? Up? How you been? Oh, technically it was supposed to be over last Monday, oh. but there was an issue last week, so we are doing one last weekend Bonus this weekend. Bonus weekend, gotcha. Nice. And then, do you like melt everything? How does that, how do you uh, dismantle a ice skating ring? You turn I'm it curious. Off. Yeah, you oh my god, dude! We're oh dead. This no. is GG. <gasps> what happens here then? Where do we load back? In. Previous room or something. Oh, okay. I totally forgot about this room. Did Can I you put on the mask? My mask is on, but that's oh, it. Oh, oh, okay. You can't leave the room? Or? I try to hide, I suppose. Oh, well, the, the alert is, yeah. Oh, I didn't notice that the music, the tempo kind of slows down. Or it speeds up and then slows down as the timer runs out. That's an interesting detail. I'm too tense to notice such a detail. <laughs> my, my sister, in, re in referring to my cat comment, my sister's overweight puss would shred the box. Oh, yeah. Maybe, maybe our tofu as well. Tofu bites boxes. Yeah, bites yeah, yeah. Paper, cardboard. Oh, yeah. Those, um, you know, those uh, kind of like scratching uh cardboard uh, what are they called? corrugated yeah corrugated cardboard or board um things he absolutely wrecks those the mochi meals had the half and half fries yeah they still do they still do yeah i think they so. still do and then zero says gotta set the compressors to defrost mode and then oh. let the sun do the rest of the work gotcha. <gasps> how cool Where the heck are we going here? I totally to forgot already. Mode. And happy new year to you, Serial Mate. How are you doing? Hope you had a, a good new year, 2022. Yeah, happy right. new year. Yeah, so the gas mask really helps here. Yeah, it seemed like it. It slows it down quite a bit, though, the uh, oxygen depletion. Yeah, a box is part of a balanced breakfast. Don't we have a higher level card key now so we could potentially get stuff here? Oh, were there? Is there anything rooms worth getting here? Yeah, I'm just gonna go though. Huh? So was Autocon just being strange? Wait, I don't think this is where we're going. F. Yeah, this is not where we're going. Oh. This is not where we're meant to go. We what? came out of here, remember? Because that was on the way to Autocon and oh, the ninja right. fight. Autocon was just being strange. Yes. He was acting strange indeed. I guess I was reading into it too much, though. That he was deliberately misleading you? Yeah. If anything, I just sensed some hesitation in his voice. Hmm. Maybe, it's, <gasps> maybe it's basement one, then. He knows who Sniper Wolf is. And so he tell doesn't... Us, tell, us, tell us your thoughts. On okay, it. well, I'm thinking back at the conversation, and Snake was like, Oh, Meryl's shot by a really talented sniper. I need a good sniper rifle to fight her with. And then uh, Snake was like, oh, wh where's the sniper rifle? And it kind of seemed like Otacon was reluctant to say. So now I'm thinking after we said we're, we're meeting with a sniper, maybe Otacon knows something. Something. I mean, he's worked here for a while, right? It, it went, maybe he's developed a relationship with the people here. Oh, let's check these. I'm going to save the game. Oh, I don't think they planned the card system too well. You got to take off the gas mask to open the doors. Yeah. All right, let's uh, check in with everyone and then let's save it okay, too. Okay, sounds good. Well, we got the sniper rifle now. You 
got a PSG one. Talk about Could backtracking, right? Hurry up and save Thank you for the help, everyone. Thank you. Uh, yeah, Rapper. that that must have been a point of uh, frustration for a lot of people. I feel like, like, oh, you gotta go all the way back you here. Need to make snap decisions in war, the difference between living and dying is counted in milliseconds. I haven't heard from Deep Throat in a while. We still don't know who that is. Yeah. F. Maybe if you call like five times in a row. <laughs> yeah. What is it? Wolf. Oh my god, that basically confirms it. <laughs> Check him again. That basically confirms it. Woo. That basically confirms it. <gasps> it is so ironic. People are working as slaves to pay for weapons that must never be used. Weapons that target the people themselves. It is madness. What's up, Snake? Ooh. <laughs> Crudy, I know her. Oh, Crudy knows. <laughs> uh, In China, they say, oh. rashness brings success to few, misfortune to many. Snake, go forward when it's safe, but retreat when there's danger. You'll just have to play it by ear depending on the circumstances. Uh, Serial May has been sick for a week. Oh. Got a pretty bad headache out of nowhere. Can't complain. There's people that are enduring a lot worse, so I'm chilling. Oh, I yeah, hope you're feeling better yeah, soon. Yeah, I hope so. So we headache. have this. Oh. Oh. What? That's going to help. Anti-anxiety drug. What did you read the second part? Yeah, temporarily stops involuntary trembling. Which may help with. Oh. Um. Yeah, I feel like headache. having a headache is the worst symptom yeah. of any it's just sickness. There, yeah. yeah, I can deal with like, you know, nausea, you know, s stomach things, postnasal drip, but headache is the worst. I struggle with postnasal drip. Yeah. Uh, sniper wo wolf, serial mate. Sniper wolf indeed. <laughs> they hold an Alaskan Christmas party at the base every year, total company party. At this base? That's yeah. just how uh, oh. Otacon knows everyone because of the party. Oh, okay, what? it didn't work. Did. <laughs> I was like, this dog. Wait, this it, no, wolf. no, it's because I'm probably because I'm moving. Oh, okay, I was like, this wolf definitely sees you. <laughs> yeah, I feel bad. Yeah, Meryl's fine. You got plenty of time, Cootie says. Yeah, I'm just trying to rush it. I mean, they go. did say wolf will camp out for days. I'm just going. For her prey. Didn't work know. because you missed something. Uh oh. I'm vaguely remembering what that something is. But maybe not. Hey, Otacon leaving you on red. Like, right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> At least. Uh, At least he picked up once. Should I save here? I'll save here again. Ooh. What and am I Rosie, hello. How are you? Thanks for popping in. I know. I can't use it in a narrow space like this, right? Right. I'm sorry. No reason to apologize. Hi, Rosie. Even the greatest masterpiece has its flaws. Oh, I missed the puppy. Gotcha. Oh, you can take the puppy. I guess so. <gasps> I guess there's a lot of little things I don't remember. It's been a while. The Chinese say it is the strong swimmer who most often drowns. It is because the strong swimmer overestimates his abilities and underestimates the strength of the river. You are probably quite used to the mission now, but don't get careless. Ooh, I like, I like that expression. Wallace, oh snap. Oh hey, snap hey, indeed, Wallace. Wallace. We are, uh, we just did, or not just, but we, we did the Psycho Mantis fight, which is very exciting. Um, and now- Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay, oh. let's get out of here. Now, and we've just acquired a sniper rifle. Oh my god. <gasps> and I think we're gonna have a <laughs> shoot off with Sniper Wolf or something. How is this Die. gonna go though? Oh, I wasted that. Um, Rosie! Yes, we got raided by Duck Funker Deluxe. We did, we, we did, did yeah. Rosie. Oh, no, that was a joke, Crudy says, about the puppy. Oh, okay. Oh, but it was a hint? Maybe it was a hint. I'm vaguely remembering something, but I don't know. Exactly. Okay, okay. Hey, 
Amberlon, how are you doing? Bay hey, Ling. Um, is Mei Ling best girl? Is that what we're saying, Amberlon? Uh, Rosie, what kind of sniper? Sniper Wolf. We actually have not spoken to Sniper Wolf directly. We've just seen the... Uh, oh, oh, nice. <gasps> oh, is that a heart your heartbeat? Yeah, and its control is vibrating oh. everything, too. Ouch. Otherwise, would it be like beating much faster if you didn't take the anti-anxiety? It's a... Uh, it shakes. Whoa. Like that? Oh. Yeah, this is spooky indeed, Stereo Mate. Um, Goody, but what the others meant has to do with it, too. Can't just steal it. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll keep that in mind. Uh, Rosie says, uh, Duck is a very nice guy. Oh, yeah. Nice. We all call him Ducky. Gotcha, oh, nice. gotcha. We'll remember that. Ducky, Ducky. I forgot Bay Ling was a thing. Oh, wait. That's a thing? Oh. Oh, because her name is Mei Ling, and Bay rhymes with Mei. Bay Ling. Fudge. Gotcha. I do like Mei Ling. Dang it. This is a pretty cool fight. Yeah. Because if she hits me, then I go like... <gasps> yeah. You killed her? I got her. Oh, God. Well, I guess she... Oh, where's Meryl? Headshot and she isn't dead. Okay. I mean... Video game rules. Uh, you don't have to be so formal. You can go just call me Serial. Will gotcha. do. Thanks for all the help, everyone. I'm Who like remembering know? some things really well and other things like totally forgetting. That's okay. Well done. You did that pretty easily. Yeah, I it's thought. also on easy difficulty. I mean. All right. On here, you see the blood trail? So, seemingly got away. Okay. So everyone's pretty much gotten away except Psycho Mantis. I feel like. Oh! We got caught. This is story related. Okay. It's hard to miss when you're this close. <gasps> Toss your weapon over here. Thank you, Serial. Slowly. Appreciate it. You are a fool to come back here, stupid man. A lady sniper, huh? Mm, didn't you know that two-thirds of the world's greatest assassins are women? Do you want to die now? Or after your female friend? Which will it be? I'll die after I kill you. <laughs> Is that right? Well, at least you've got spirit. They haven't given her an intro yet, right? Oh, here. Sniper Wolf. There we are. And really I more. always kill what I aim at. Oh. oh, I like her vocal fry. You're my special prey. Got it. <gasps> oh. oh! I've left my mark on you. <gasps> I won't forget it. Oh, that must hurt a lot. Until I kill you, you're all I think about. <laughs> Wait, why don't we just kill him now? Why doesn't Take she just away. Oh. Okay. Don't kill me yet. I ah, that's why. Leave it to me. I want no more exercise like that. Don't. Yes, he's my target. My mind. The DARPA chief was um, Donald Anderson. The first person we met when we came here? First heart attack, yeah. No, I want no more accidents. I, I still... That so here, I can move the camera here. Oh, nice. 
That whole thing was suspicious to me still. Is tougher than I thought. Do you know who I am? I always knew that one day I would meet you. The man who stole what was rightly mine. The man who stole my birthright. Stole my birthright. Forget it. Your body is strapped down tight. Who's that? Me. You don't recognize the voices? I'm the man you stole nope. everything good from. Okay. And now, after the sacrifice of Well, this is Liquid Marcus, Snake. Mm. After 30 Maybe the other one is years, um the tank guy. The two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Yeah, female armor is way stronger than male armor. Yeah, That's why there is so little of it, coach, you know. Do you think little brother? Or should I say big brother? Oh, first I'm not meeting. Sure. Anyway, it doesn't matter. You and I are both the last surviving sons of big boss. It's me. Really? It was also last voice. Then what? Oof, those idiots. Mm. All right, Raven. I'll be right there. They're not responding to our demands. We launched the first one in 10 hours as planned. Damn Americans. Looks like you read them wrong. Something's funny. Normally the Americans are the first ones to the negotiating table. They must think they've got something up their sleeves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're going to launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, Ocelot. What about you? Wanna stay for the show? I'm not interested. It's time to feed the family. So you prefer your wolves to my show, huh? Ocelot, don't screw up like you did with the chief. Yes, I know. That was an accident. I didn't think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Well, his mental defenses were reinforced by hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? He's killed 12 men. Whoever he is, he's some kind of lunatic. Oh! He took my hand. How could he have gotten in here? I know what's gonna happen now. Perhaps there's a spy among us. Mantis is dead. We've also got to find oh. out what killed Baker and Octopus. We're short-handed, so make this little torture show of yours as short as possible. Torture? This is an interrogation. As you wish. See you later. Who's Octopus mother. again? Decoy Octopus was one of the, um, but apparently Decoy Octopus is dead. Oh, so we never even got to see. Yeah. Oh, so. But a woman oh. is still in this world. Meryl. 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 Later. Handsome. Oh. Once she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Sometimes she even falls in love with them before she kills them. Finally, just the two of us. How are you feeling? Not bad. Caught a nice nap on this revolving bed of yours. Too bad I was sleeping alone. I'm glad to hear that. This is some bed, all right. I'm about to show you some of its nicer features. Oh, feet. no. Where are my things? Oh, don't worry. They're all there. Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. This is the torture Someone scene. must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, carrier boy? So... Metal Gear is armed with a new type of nuclear warhead, huh? Why don't you go ask Campbell for the full story? The Colonel? By oh. the way, oh, God. you got an optical disc from President Baker, didn't you? What if I did? Is that the only disc? There's no other data? What do you mean? There's no copy? Do not. That's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Wolf must have been feeling generous. What if you want her to stay that way? You better start answering my questions right now. You were holding one card key. Oh. Where are the other two? What's the trick behind that key? Trick? That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. I see. No problem then. What? We're going to play a game, Snake. They're just dumping so much information on you. Man you really are. 
your pain becomes too great to bear. Just give up, and your suffering will end. What if you do? The girl's life is mine. Uh oh. So what do you want to try? You want to do it? What is this a button mashing thing? Press the circle button repeatedly. Uh, I'm on the easy difficulty. I'm so not good at enough. these. Press the select button to. What, what, what does select mean? Like, I think select game over. Oh. Zero. The game. Maybe. So don't, I don't ever know. click select. There are I don't know. Continues, my friend. There are no continues. Don't even think about using auto, <laughs> or I'll know. <laughs> Turbo. Damn. I'm going to run a high voltage electric current through your body. Okay, Audrey's trying this. It's just for a short time, okay. it won't kill you. But I never heard that before. Oh, my arms are already yeah, tired. Guys. Okay. Circle. But Circle. I've got some bad news for you. Circle. You're no POW. You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. You should be. Oh, God. Okay. Here we Let's go. Get started. Here we go. Uh, when do I go? Okay, It'll be clear. Here we okay. Go. <laughs> See, not so bad. How did you like that? I didn't know the controller was gonna vibrate so that hard. So the, the that's controller the that's the electric pulse going uh, yeah, through your body. Yeah, that makes sense. The controller started like moving around my desk mat because oh. I put it down flat. See, you're doing great. Keep going when the time runs out too. See. Had enough yet? Yes, please. We're not no more. You're doing great. Oh, God. Why are you screaming too? I don't know. <laughs> it helps. <laughs> uh, oh no! Oh no! 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 Here. Oh God. I'm so You're tired. A strong man. I'm so tired. No, that's enough for now. Oh, okay. Okay. You're so tired. You got tougher, right? I'm sorry. You got tougher. Oh yeah, I got tougher. I'm so tired. Who else could shoot down two F sixteens <laughs> with a hind helicopter? I'm sorry. Yes, I was. <laughs> I was screaming at smoke glass emperor. Are you reading everything? Oh. He is the one man who could make my dream into a reality. Who? <laughs> Lego Snake? He was talking about how liquid is awesome this whole ah. time. And something called the Les Enfants Terribles project was not a waste after all. Oh. Les Enfants Terribles? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this game often has a ton of information dumps. Yeah, and they, they just kind of like sneak it into the conversation. Yeah. Huh? Looks like I got a roommate. Oh, see? The DARPA chief? Yeah, I knew it. Knew what? Oh, wait, no, he's dead. I thought he, was, I thought he wasn't dead yet. <laughs> what a stink. Wait, it's the guy from the beginning, right? Donald the very beginning? Anderson. Donald Anderson? The DARPA chief Donald but Anderson. But he, he's definitely dead. That witch, she took my clothes. What? Does that ring any bells? That witch, she took my clothes? Is that familiar? No. Wait, what? This guy sneezed. He has a cold. Uh-huh. Some woman cold? took his clothes. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yes, that's familiar to me. Yes. So this is probably the soldier that Meryl took the the clothes from that's why she was sneaking around w wearing some soldier's clothes right yeah yeah right. we'll yeah, get yeah, there yeah. Crudy. i want to make sure audrey doesn't miss anything are you okay i've been better how's mara they've got her damn snake the government has decided not to give in to their demands we're trying to buy some more time come on colonel why don't you stop playing dumb mm -hmm. i'm yeah. sorry about meryl but i want the lies to end now what are you talking about? Metal Gear was designed to launch a new type of nuclear warhead, wasn't it? You knew it all along, didn't you? Why did you try to hide it? I'm sorry. Can't tell the grunts, huh? You've changed a lot. Metal Gear, secret advanced nuclear weapons research. Does the White House know about this? How deep does it go? As far as I know, as of yesterday, the president had not been briefed about the Rex project. Need to know basis, is that the idea? Mm. These are sensitive times. 
Even subcritical nuclear tests are causing quite a stir. Plausible deniability, huh? Yes. And tomorrow, the President and his Russian counterpart are scheduled to sign the START III Accord. I get it. That's the reason for the deadline. That's right, Snake. And that's why we can't let this terrorist attack go public. We still haven't even ratified START II or dealt with the issue of TMDs. This has to do with the President's reputation and America's place as the dominant superpower. So patriotism is your excuse for circumventing the Constitution? Please, Snake. Just stop them. Mm. Why should I? Because you're the only one who can. In that case, tell me the truth about this new type of nuclear warhead. I told you before. I don't know the details. I don't believe you. If the situation is so serious, why don't you give in to their demands? Let them have Big Boss's remains. You see... Or is there some reason that you can't do that? Something you haven't told me about. Publicly, the President has been very vocal in his opposition to eugenics experiments. We don't want the existence of the Genome Army to go Ooh. public. And that's the only reason? Oh my goodness. Huh. Hell with you. I'm sorry. The corpse of the DARPA chief is lying right here next to me. Oh man. But it's strange. Ah, it smells like he's yes. been dead for days. Okay, okay. All his blood's been drained out too. Drained? Maybe to slow down decomposition? I have no idea. But the chief only died a few hours ago, right? Ah. Right. But he's already started to decompose. Okay. What could it all be about? Something in his blood that they wanted? I doubt it. Just the nanomachines in the transmitter. Did the chief tell them his detonation code? I'm afraid so. It looks like they've got both codes and are nearly ready to launch. Damn. Wait, they did? Is there any way to prevent it? It seems that there's some type of emergency override device that can cancel out the detonation code. It's a countermeasure that Armstech installed secretly. You have to unlock it with three special card keys. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. Dude. I'm sorry to have to lay it all in your lap, but you're all I've got. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Also. What? I know it's asking a lot. Meryl, right? Yeah. I'll save her. Thanks. Wait. <sighs> how, wait how did they get the code? I'm no longer gonna answer some of your questions. Is it Im Please implied? Understand. Wait, how did how did Snake know that they got the code? It's like, oh, it looks when he like was they talking got to oh, when he was talking to Donald Anderson when we first met him. Yeah, he said, "I I talked." He said, "I gave them the code." I Do you recall he, that? Do you recall? He, oh, because he didn't have the training that mm -hmm. the other guy did, and then the other guy was like, "No, he should have had the same training as mm -hmm. I did." That's how he was able to resist. But mm -hmm. did he give the codes that? that did the other guy give the code anyway? How did he get the code? Baker? Yeah, Which Baker, guy? Baker, Baker. Baker. Mm -hmm. Baker wasn't prepared for the physical torture. Ah, oh, right, right, right. So he gave up the code. Okay. So they do have both the codes. Mm -hmm. Now there's something up with this body, this Donald Anderson. And the blood is drained. And it looks like it's been dead for a lot longer. Blood has been drained, and it's been dead for a lot longer. Mm hmm so there's this Donald Anderson, but then there's this Donald Anderson that we talked to today. Something with the blood, something with this and that. I'm just being careful to only tell you the stuff that... I'm just helping something you remember the, the things that have already been told to us in the game. Yeah. I'm being very careful, guys. It's weird. And you should too, please. There's two Donald Andersons? Uh, I'm going to call more people, if that's okay. Soldier is taken prisoner. He should only give up the big four. Big it's four. name, rank, serial number, and date of birth. But you're not any old soldier, Snake. I don't want you to tell them anything. Fortunately, you're strong enough to resist. Okay. Nope. It's not gonna work. Just because you are locked up does not mean there is no chance of escape. Keep your eyes and ears open, and when you see a chance, take it. 
perfect cereal. Appreciate it. <laughs> Otacon, are you still okay? Yeah, thanks to the stealth camouflage, that is. I have a favor to ask. I need your help. I was wondering when you'd ask, what should I do? I've been captured. I'm locked up here in this cell. What cell? There's a big torture machine nearby. Okay, I know it. It's close. I'll be there. Oh, nice. Thanks. Oh, wow. Snake, are you okay? I feel so scared for you. It must be horrible. <sighs> I've been through a lot worse. <laughs> believe me. Wow, you really are a hero. It's a good thing the codec is connected directly to your inner ear. You can contact us anytime. It's always nice to hear that you're all right. Why don't you contact the colonel? If anyone can think of a way out, it's him. Good thing we already did. Um, yeah, if only you had a keyblade. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Kojiro. <laughs> I think about that daily. Please, Nick, don't give up. <laughs> Big Brain, I'm being so careful that I don't even know any spoilers. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for being so careful Perfect. and vigilant. Are there any plans to play Metal Gear Solid 2 sometime after this? No promises, but mm. we're just going to wing in it, seeing how we feel. We don't want to like promise that this is like the year of Metal Gear or anything yeah, like no that. Yeah, no specific plans, but, but we're open, open, open to it. To it. Yeah. But thank you for the interest, Kojo. Did you save Colonel for last for a reason? No, we already did. Oh, we're oh, oh. First. But Mailing was like, oh, talk to the Colonel or something. I'm just trying to, I'm just going to do stuff that I think I remember seeing. All right, let's think ahead. Why is this Donald's body all what decomposed? The hell are you doing? <laughs> Can I always call Colonel again? Okay. That voice was so funny. have a chance to escape hang on oh okay so this is like a timed at thing. least they have like they have so much recorded dialogue in this game yeah i wonder if we're gonna be able to see otacon like slipping by yeah kojiro i do remember some of that stuff snake don't worry okay. you can do this too Shut up. that's funny Shut up in there, will you? can you talk to the body or interact with the body no We can look at it. Not even saying anything. Yuck. Look at those maggots. Hmm. Oh, he's sneezing? Shut up. Yeah, he just said that earlier, right? I, I just I just So he has a cold, he understood sneezed. what that sound was. I was like, is he yelling or No items. Oh. Snake. It's showtime. Oh, uh, the shining kid sees dead people, and Snake. Talks LJR, yeah, to thank dead you for people. tuning in. Thank you for the follow. Thank you, Sorry, LJR. I had to delete your message. Uh oh. Just want to be careful. This is Audrey's first playthrough. Don't want to spoil anything for her. Thank you, LJR, for the follow. That's We're a mini being pretty careful about you. spoilers. I may say things out loud, but um, I don't want any clarification. You oh, you strength. have to do it again. Yeah. When you've had enough, press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. There are no continues, my friend. I fought wars in Afghanistan, Mozambique, Eritrea, and Chad. Among the Mujahideen guerrillas, I was known and feared as Shalashaska. Whoa. I was trained by the Russian group. I am not like one of those KGB slugs. To me, this isn't torture. It's a sport. You're all just a bunch of sadists. Don't confuse me with those uniform fools. Well, shall we begin? Gosh. Same okay, LJR. Here we go. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in. Here we go. That guard's voice acting is perfect between his genuine panic from you going under the bed to him being upset about your boxing practice. Yeah. Like that? I like the the way he delivered. What are you doing? Or, you know, it sounded like kind of it sounded kind of funny. Dude. Woo. Well done. Arm feels tired already. 
We're not finished yet. So this must be the physical torture that uh, <gasps> Baker was talking about. Yeah. You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for now, I think. We live in a sad age. Imperialism, totalitarianism, perestroika. 20th century <laughs> Russia has had its share of problems, but at least they had an ideology. Russia today has nothing. They're struggling between freedom and order, and with that struggle, a new spirit of nationalism has been born. The boss has a close friend high up in the Russian government. He's currently the head of Spetsnaz. He's agreed to purchase this new nuclear weapons system. Ooh. The Hind was just a down payment. The helicopter at the beginning. Ah. Money. I don't need money. I want Russia to be reborn, to lead a brave new world order. At what age are people playing this game? Because I feel Good question, like yeah. it's the, rated M for mature, though, right on the box. Oh, maybe I'm just thinking like so the that. story feels like complex. Complex. I can't really imagine myself as a kid playing this. Um, Ooh. Hey, Solid Snake. And really understanding. In. And Solid Snake, hello, how are you doing? Yeah, Kojo. After the torture section, Snake looks at Otakon and says, "Harder." Which fanfic is this, Kojo? <laughs> Here we go. Okay. You okay, Snake? Yeah. Nothing new to report. Snake, is there anything I can do? Yeah. My arm hurts. Poor Snake. I'll increase the level of painkillers in your blood. Oh, okay. you can do that? But you can leave out the Benzedrine. That stuff makes me too frisky. <laughs> I guess you're not feeling too bad after all. Snake, put the controller up against your arm. Okay. What? What? Don't worry. It'll feel good. <laughs> okay, here I go. <gasps> How fun! How does that feel, Snake? A little better? <laughs> How did you do it's that? It's like a Theragun. <laughs> I stimulated your muscle fibers with the nano machine. That's Julia. so fun. That's about all I can do for you. <laughs> Naomi, please talk to me. Isn't that awesome? Say something to take. It's more of that stuff. Of pain. What can I say? Anything. Oh. I... I'm not a very good talker. Please, tell me about yourself. Oh, here we Myself. go. That's a tough one. Any family? That's not a happy topic for me. I don't have any family. No, wait. There was a man Whoa, who said he was, was my father. This song. Where is he? Dead. By my own hand. Big boss. What? Wait, did we know that? I had no idea. Did we know? There's no way you could. It happened in Zanzibar six years ago. I... Only Snake and I know the real truth. I forgot. Wait, there. did we read that? No. Oh. Is it like we had to have played it, I think. Was it oh. thanks for your father? That's what he said. That's all I know. And you were able to kill Whoa. him. Whoa. Knowing that. Yep. How? We wanted it. Besides, some people just... Whoa! That's patricide. Yep. That's yep. the trauma that Mantis was talking about. Ah. One we share in common. <gasps> oh. Is that why you left Foxhound? Let's just say that I needed to be alone for a while. And Alaska was the perfect mm. place. <sighs> Snake. I didn't have a real family either. Just a big brother who put me through school. We weren't even blood related, and he was much older than me. Where is he? He's dead. I'm sorry. No, he's not. Snake. Dead to me, but not. Is there not a woman in your life? After you've been through as many wars as me, it's hard to trust anyone. Hmm. Friends? Roy Campbell. <laughs> <laughs> You're still calling me friend? Is that it? No. There was another. <gasps> Gray Frank Fox? Yeager. Oh no. What? Big Boss's most trusted lieutenant. Frank? And the only member of Fox Hound oh. ever to receive the code name Fox. It is Gray Fox? Gray Fox. <gasps> Frank Yeager. I learned a lot from him. But didn't you try to kill each other? 
It's true. We did, in Zanzibar. But it was nothing personal. We were just professionals on opposite sides, that's all. And you still call yourself friends? Hard to believe. War is no reason to end a friendship. Dude. That's insane. I first met him on the battlefield. He was being held a prisoner of outer heaven, but he didn't look like a prisoner to me. He was always so cool and precise. I was still green, and he showed me the ropes. You knew him well? No. We never mm. talked about our personal lives. Sort of an unwritten rule. The next time I saw him on the battlefield, we were enemies. We were fighting barehanded in a minefield. Dude. I know it sounds strange to most people, but we were just two soldiers doing our jobs. It's like a sport. Men in their games. You're like wild animals. You're right. We are animals. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? I don't know. <sighs> it's your genes. They make you predisposed towards violence. You really like talking about genes, Naomi. Why did you get into genetic research anyway? I never knew who my parents were, or even what they looked like. I guess I got into genetics because I wanted to figure out why I am the way I am. So you studied about DNA? <laughs> yeah. I thought if I studied my genetic structure, I'd find out who I really was. I thought that by analyzing a person's genetic information, I could retrieve the blank spots in that person's memory. Memory is stored in DNA? We're not sure, but we know that a person's genetic fate is determined just by the sequence of the four bases in their DNA. Genetic fate? So what about my fate? You know my DNA sequence, don't you? Your fate? I... I'm sorry, I have no idea. Of course not. You're a scientist, not a fortune teller. Genetic fate. There's a nature versus nurture argument to be had here, I'm sure. Certainly. Um. Oh, oh, I know about this. Oh man, that guy had Taco Bell. Taco Bell. <laughs> the cleanse. Okay, now's our chance. Um, yeah, Emberlon, don't tell my parents that you played this game at a young age. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's all the fanfics. Kodri says, "Gotcha, gotcha." Oh, okay. oh, LGR was in elementary school playing this game. God, it, the story feels. Oh, George, George. I see. Complex. Hey, I'm here. Where? Nice. Why did you hide? Just because? There's multiple ways to get out of this situation. Oh. Okay. It's me, Otacon. Wow, they even captured you. Hurry, get me out of here. It, let me go. That hurts. Hurry up. Whoa. Is that how you ask a guy a favor? Let me go. Jeez, it's like an animal's cage. Oh, what a smell. Uh, because of him. Yeah, why do they keep the body there? Yeah, it's the Derpa chief. It's just a place you know, to put it right next to the torture stuff. I'll be laying mm. next to him. Those bastards. This lock won't open with a security card. You need a key like the soldiers carry. So what are you doing here then? I, I thought you might be hungry. If you need more food, I can bring some more later. Is that a also, ketchup bottle? I you this level six card. Nice. And we'll get you out of that oh, torture. Nice. Level six. Here, take this too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Why? I don't know why, but she's oh. nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm Syndrome to me. I was taking care of the dogs here. After the terrorists took over, they were planning to shoot all the dogs. But Sniper Wolf stopped Aww. them. She even let me feed them when I asked. She likes dogs. She must be a good person. Please don't hurt her. Whoa! Wake up, you idiot. She's the one who shot Meryl. Well, that's all I can do. Aww. They're planning to launch a nuke. I've got to stop them. Then you have to get past the communications tower. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard's got the key. You'll have to take him out. Give me a break. I'm no soldier. I can't take anybody out. You have to. I'll be killed. What's gonna happen here? <laughs> oh, jeez. 
he's coming back. See you later. Wait. Oh no. Okay, I'm just gonna do the thing that I know. Oh, okay. Oh my god. So there's a couple options here, you said? I think so. Okay. Um, LGR says, well, yeah, there are the ones on the older consoles, but I never played those. Gotcha. I played Metal Gear Solid, Sons of Liberty, Snake oh. Eater, Guns of the Patriot, and I've yet to play the fifth. Got you, LGR. Got him. Got him. <laughs> it worked. The catch up. What, what were the other methods? I don't want to say them. We'll talk about it after. Oh, we'll okay. We'll do a debriefing of the game when we're done with the game. Interesting. Okay. Sounds good. Um, well, there's one, Kojiro. What? Uh, like there's just another round of torture. Um, oh. So this is the handkerchief he gave us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Smells faintly of her. Oh, that's going to come into play with the dogs. Just want to make sure you read all that. Level six key card now. Yeah, yeah, big brain. Otacon bringing his friend in a high security torture chamber some snacks. What a guy. And of all things, a bottle Check of ketchup and what, like a can of some sort of can, can of tuna, maybe? That was for us. A can of spam. What was for us? Um. Uh, he just went behind the thing, so the camera is obscured so he could change. Gotcha. But I was just reminded of something. Are you ready? Uh-huh. Uh, no, let's just, <laughs> let's just have let's fun just with it. Maybe some people in chat know what I'm talking about. Let's just have fun with it. Okay. You caught Snake? I'm just going to roll with it. What? I have no idea what's going on. Yeah. Good luck, Snake. So we are trying to get to the communications tower. Back where uh, Sniper Wolf was. Can I just walk in the way of that camera? Wait, that's not what I want. Is it walking? Yeah. It's just what? a turret. Ah. So you're gonna do something fun right now? Maybe. Where are we? <laughs> yeah, he worked hard to get that can of spam in there. What is the can of Sam going to help us when it comes to, to torture? He's trying his best. I understand. <laughs> yeah, we're just trying to go to the communications tower where we were stopped when um, uh, Sniper Wolf caught us. Okay. But you said you were going to try something fun, you said? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just going to happen. It's just um, going to happen. Okay. Two... Oh no, we gotta go all the way back outside. Yeah. There's another route, but I'm like, I'm not as familiar with it. They make you eat the spam for torture. <laughs> I never had um like spam straight out of the can, so maybe it is. It's like fully cooked, right? I've never had it. It is, like that. but um yeah, I've only had it when it's you like too. put it on the fr fry it on the pan a little yeah. bit, give it some. This is where Texture. I messed up last time. <laughs> so give it to Ocelot. He eats it, and it's so and is so disgusted he passes out. Gotcha. What am I supposed to even do here? Because like I walk here and it makes noise. You can't crawl, maybe. I just don't know this guy's route. Is he gonna keep going south? No. Oh. We're going to trigger it again. OMG SARS with the raid! SARS Hello, raid, Sars. what's up? SARS raid, how's Thank it going? Thank you very much. Mini <laughs> party. Oh! Freaking guy! We got caught. We got up. <laughs> yeah, oh, but we got out, so everything's fine. What's Thank up, you so Sars? much for the raid, SARS. How are you doing? <laughs> Thank you. Thanks again. I'm so bad. I've always been so bad at the stealth in this game. Did did you mind just like running in and 
guns blazing or did you always try to go i always tried line? okay yeah 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 and then failed yeah and then just guns blazing <laughs> yeah i feel it's like plan b i feel like that's probably be me too yeah um how is metal gear solid it is going very well uh -huh. we had some really fun like fourth wall breaking moments yeah. moments really today special. iconic yeah. yeah very 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 cool um won't spoil them for you Yes, Abon, homie, oh my god, Metal Gear Solid, yes. Thanks for tuning in. Oh my in. god, indeed. Thanks for being here. Um, have never played any of these. Yeah, this is my first time actually sitting and like working through, uh, uh, what? technically with Anth Anthony's Snake, playing. Oh. there's a bomb planted in your items. Hurry, throw it away. <gasps> Who the hell are you? One of them? You'll find out soon enough. Um, yeah, I... See this? Uh, oh, timer. Identity unknown. 59 seconds remaining. So... It was in here when we picked up our gear. So... And oh, I it noticed was. it earlier, and this is the thing. Oh! Uh-oh. I can't, because I'm crawling. Uh, oh, wait, my no, God, we no, gotta get out of here. Can you throw it now? No. No? Press, while menu is what? It's because we're crawling. Oh, while menu is open, it says. We got to get somewhere where we can throw it. Oh, my God. Um, yeah, Shiro, uh, is this your guy's first playthrough? It is my first playthrough. Anthony, um, so we're, we both stream on this channel. My name's Audrey, and this is Anthony, and we're a married couple. Um, and we are working through Metal Gear Solid together. It's my first playthrough, but technically Anthony is... I just threw it. I just threw it. ...playing the game right now. Uh... So yeah, first playthrough. Was a close one, Snake. It's been a little while for me though. You pay for that. That deep throat's a real enigma. He's definitely from inside their ranks. Yeah, who is it? An informer. Maybe some kind of renegade. I've got the feeling there's some other force at work here. Huh. And Shido with the Oh, follow. thank you so much for Thank follow. you so much. Thank you so much for the follow. We really appreciate it. Um, let's see. Sorry, I got a little behind on chat. Yeah, yeah. I've been snake, snake, snake. We <laughs> haven't gotten a game over today. Uh, but uh, oh, yeah. oh my, my god, you scared yeah. me. <laughs> Jesus. Sorry, just the constant screaming. <laughs> you scared me. Um, <laughs> thick rain. I don't like this vent. Seen too many horror games where there's definitely something waiting for you in the vent. Oh, oh no. Oh my I don't want to know what horror game that is because that sounds terrifying. Um, oh yeah, Shiro, I love the art in the codec calls. We do too. Yeah. Um, and we love the subtle little changes in their expression. It's so effective. Yeah, like Very that. comic book vi yeah. vibes. Huh? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The scan the lines. Um, thanks for being here, Serial. And yeah, th yeah. thanks for popping in and we'll catch thanks you later. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate your enthusiasm. Have a good night. Yeah, Abin, Deep Throat is the name of that one. Uh, yeah, it's from one. the Watergate, uh, the informant in the Watergate scandal. Yeah. But yeah, I, I don't know the history behind that name in the first place. Google it. You want me to Google Deep Throat? <laughs> okay, this is where I messed up last time. Okay. There. That guy turned, and then I got spotted immediately. I love the alert track on this game. Yeah, like you mean like the alert sound? The music. Yeah. Oh, the, the oh yeah, the alert uh, music. So good, iconic. Definitely iconic. Iconic is exactly the right word. It gives you anxiety. And it does. The tempo does slow down as the timer runs. Like out. gradually. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I when, haven't when noticed that because I'm like stressed out. Yeah. When when you're in the um, I forgot the yellow alert. Mm evasion or whatever yeah something like that <sighs> then it's like totally slows down i'll have to pay attention to it. bring it up next time because i there, there will be another okay. time uh crudy recommends gas mask ready i don't know if oh in that room in case i alert oh, oh, oh in the other room gotcha gotcha yeah. it'll give me more time to uh try to uh, Shudo, are you going? Are you guys gonna play through the whole series? Um, we don't have any specific plans, but we are open to it. We're open to it, trying yeah. to see how we feel after uh, after yeah. this game. Yeah, we're we're having fun so far with this game. It's this game is really special. Yeah. We uh, we just did the Psycho Mantis boss fight earlier yeah, today. Yeah, that was awesome. It was so cool. I didn't know. I knew about the controller 
thing mm-hmm. um, before, but I didn't know that it would read your memory card. You didn't know the memory card? I, I thought you I, knew the memory card no, thing. No, I don't think I knew the memory Dude, card. Dude, so it's I, awesome. So as it was happening, I was like, oh, I see. So Audrey knows some things about Metal Gear Solid. I think so far, not all the context. those like little meta like moments like that, that th- the controller thing was like the only one I knew. Yeah. So I didn't know Wait, about now, the... Anthony, do you remember? <gasps> Ooh. So I didn't know about the um, the back of the box to get Meryl's frequency. Like just this, and I'm safe, right? Are they going to show hearts? Oh, they're so cute. Oh, yeah, they do. It's just, is it just this? That's it. Seems like. Okay, now I can. I might safely be able to explore. There's some stuff here, I think. Nice. That fight was so good. Yeah, it was, Abin. So good. But maybe I won't explore. We're just we're just going. Or boxes. Rathor, you're talking about just boxes allowing me to hide from them, right? Is that it? Or is there something more to the boxes here? <laughs> LGR, oh god, that room. See see playing this as a kid took me forever to figure out. Yeah. Uh that other room or, or which room? This this room here? The mantis fight room, maybe. Oh, the mantis fight room. That's my oh, guess. oh yeah, I can't. Ima- yeah, with Psycho Mantis, LJR says. Yeah, I can't imagine oh, figuring out. Oh god, say so yeah, I have to memorize this. Wait, what? Shortcut. Really? I can't imagine um, being able to figure out some of these things. <laughs> Pretty brutal. Well, like what? The abdomen and maybe the upper the thigh leg, and yeah. then her arm? Yeah. Sniped. Unless they gave her some sort of treatment, I feel like it would be over for Meryl. But I did see her in the fourth game, so I think she makes it. <laughs> Unless it's some weird like twin thing like uh, with liquid snakes. So Audrey has vague memories of Metal Gear Solid 4, but that's like, that's it. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Years ago, and, watching and, her and brother play. At the time, I didn't really have context. So. Certainly, that game requires context. And Arthur said, don't "No movie, stay me. still." With oh, the cardboard box. gotcha. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, if something occurred off screen, they alive, Abin. Yeah, I, I live by that done. philosophy for I'm movies Carol. as well. Okay. Colonel, I'm sorry. Listen to me. I wasn't able to protect her. Snake, she's a soldier. She knows that prisoners are a part of war. Mm-hmm. She joined up of her own free will. I'm sure she was prepared for this. No, you're wrong. Meryl thought she had to become a soldier. Thought it was the only way. She said she thought it would bring her closer to her dead father. She said that. Are they monitoring this she at all times? For real combat. I shouldn't have pushed her so hard. You mean Campbell? It's them? All my fault. Yeah. Yeah. It's not like you, Snake. Oh. Master. What is it? <laughs> they call him Master too. Dropping, but I just couldn't listen anymore. Master Miller. Master. Snake. You can have regrets if you want to. It's only natural. But you can't keep attacking yourself for things that happened in the past. That road leads to madness. Believe me. He's right. Don't kick yourself. It doesn't suit a legend like you. I'm sure Meryl's just fine. Mei Ling. Snake. Forget about Meryl. Stop Liquid. That's what Meryl would want too. You're right. Meryl would say the same thing. Snake. What? Meryl, she's pretty special to you, huh? Yes, she's special. There aren't many women like her around. That's not what I meant. She's the Colonel's niece and a combat buddy. Is that all? Come on. This is like a police interrogation. <laughs> no, I just... I guess it's in the genes. Oh my god. Genes. What are you talking about, Colonel? <laughs> no, I just remembered about Naomi's grandfather. <laughs> I think Naomi said he rose as high as assistant secretary in the FBI during Edgar Hoover's time. Is that right? Yes. 
Yes, uh, he was uh, Japanese, and he became a special undercover investigator to nab the Mafia. When was that? Oh, uh, sometime in the 50s, I guess. Where? Uh, New York, I think. Naomi, I thought you didn't have any family. Well, I, I researched it after I became an adult. My grandfather was already dead by the time I learned about him. I never even had the chance to meet him. Oh. Snake, good luck. Watch your back, Snake. Hmm? Wait, what? What? Did I miss something? What was all that? Just share with us what you're thinking. I, I, I think I maybe like zoned out because I, I didn't understand what just happened. The conversation is just a lot of stuff just happens. The characters all have their own motivations and they're all doing things. So they said, oh, it's something in your genes about like wanting to know about Snake. And Just being inquisitive and investigative because yeah. uh, her grandfather rose to high ranks in the <laughs> fudge. Assistant secretary in the FBI, mm. as in oh, okay. the FBI. Okay. So and that's what that's what he meant. And then uh, people Master were saying, Miller. Oh, you! I, like, I thought, I thought you, you didn't have, have family. Where? When? Who? I thought you didn't have family. Oh. Okay. And then, so what? What is your exactly? Um, everyone's got an agenda. Yeah, but I mean, yeah, yeah. so now that you have that, what? What are your what are your thoughts? I I don't know. I have no idea. Okay. Nothing about how she responded. How did like? What do you mean? How she responded? She was a little Defensive? caught off guard. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Dark. I think I, that's, I that's the takeaway. That's I mean, the takeaway. Yeah, I see that it happened, but okay. I don't know what that means in the. Okay. Just want to make sure you didn't things. miss that. Oh no, I didn't. Um, yeah, Koji, I never played Metal Gear Solid Four, and I'm so sorry. I, I probably shouldn't be talking about anything past this game. Yeah. Um, it's okay. We'll definitely stop doing that. Um. Yeah, Master Miller cuts off the music playing in the background. Yeah, I thought it was supposed to be some epic like change in tone or something, but <laughs> the music just kind of oh. Combat buddy, yeah. We're just combat buddies. Combat buddies can cuddle, it's okay. We got some rope. <laughs> Campbell, stop liquid. Me. I'll go get a towel. Good one, Kojiro. Yeah, Shudo, uh, codec calls have a lot going but on in terms of narrative. Definitely. I think that's where all the narrative happens. And the occasional, you know, actual cutscene. But. Anthony's been making an effort to go into uh, codec calls pretty much at every Absolutely. after every um, major thing. Yeah, and it's yeah, been rewarding. Yeah, it, it reveals more for sure. And yes, everyone's got an agenda. There's no. Uh, it's not black or white. Everything's morally gray here. Okay. Feel free to look away if you have if you're feeling motion sickness. No problem. I don't know if you notice the alert. We're just on everyone's on high alert right now. Yeah. Oh no, as in there's no hiding. Oh right, right, right. This is a just go situation. I highly recommend you guys play uh MGSR. Revengeance? Oh, Revengeance. Okay. Even I though have not played that one. It's not really part of the main series. Okay. Yeah, recommendation I hope to play mind. it one day. Oh my god. Around and around we go. When we stop, I'm gonna puke, Kojiro. That's why I'm lo looking away right now. I'm looking at chat. <laughs> Solid Snake says, I did not like this part of the game. You mean this round and round kind of endless waves of enemies, enemies kind of thing? This is like less tactical espionage and more action. Yeah. I skipped that door. I just want to make sure I get items. Kojiro played Revengeance and enjoyed it. Has some awesome music. Cool. Wait, should I have gone through that door? Is it the same Metal Gear... Uh, or is it the same music composer across all the Metal Gear games? As far as I know, Harry Gregson Williams. I'm just gonna go through that door. Okay. My instinct is to, you know, check everywhere in case there's items. Sure. Same with yours, I'm sure. Yeah. 
but you this have is the pretty level annoying. six. Right? I do. Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. Snake, that's the door to the walkway. It won't open, even if I use the card. Huh? Oh, that's right. I totally forgot. Do you know something? That door sometimes gets frozen shut because mm. it's oh. cold outside. Next time, tell me beforehand. So, what should I do? It's impossible to open from the inside. They always used C4 or something from the outside. Holy cow. From the outside? You can't open it from the inside? Sorry, it's impossible. But don't worry, you'll get through. Mm. There are two walkways that connect Tower A and Tower B. The other one's on the roof. You should just use the walkway on the roof. All right, so I was supposed to go up. Yeah, but it's good that you checked. Otherwise, you would have never knew known. Um... Oh, Revengeance has tracks with actual lyrics to them. Neat. Oh, I forgot to <gasps> equip the rations. Oh. I forgot to switch back over to rations. It's okay. Oh, no. When did we last save? This is a continue, right? Gosh. Dang it. Okay. It's okay. We're okay. We're okay. Um. Yeah, I, I do like a lot of the Metal Gear music. Namely, the... um. The vocal songs across the game. Certainly. Yeah, I, I, I go. I actually listen to those with somewhat regularity. Without having played the games, I like them. <laughs> uh, Gregson Williams is Metal Gear Solid 2. Oh, just 2? Yeah, Metal Gear Solid 1 is like five different composers according to Wikipedia. Oh, wow. Which okay. seems like more of a nice thing to have that many. Okay, cool. This goes to show it's explosive. Explosives and swearing don't solve all your problems. You're not using enough. Words to live by? Sag and Deej, you know. Okay, we're just gonna keep going to the roof then. This song is really good. Mm -hmm. I feel like for any, um, like, video game like parody or anything like that if it involves like getting caught it's it's, it's got to be this song you know it gives <laughs> me the same vibes what some of the phoenix Wright music dude um i can see that like um i would say like oh that's like i i caught you yeah yeah in your own lie yep. or something like that sort of feel yeah, definitely. One of the songs became a mean a meme in itself. Oh, okay. Oh, one of one of the songs. Oh, oh, I see. Revengeance music is also dynamic with certain fights as well. Oh, so uh, a song from Revengeance became a meme in itself. Dynamic music. Love that. Yeah, that's pretty special when a game does that. Kind of like near music. Yeah. Um, seven remake, pretty dynamic. Yeah, you're right. The layers. Yeah. Communications tower. Now I want to see Snake in court. Yes. <laughs> Objection. Yeah. <laughs> We have the rations equipped now. Running low on ammo on the farmers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. We're nearly there. We're here. So calm mean? Great question. There was something else I there were a couple like acronym things that I that have been throughout the stream where I'm <sighs> like, oh I wonder what that means or a couple couple other uh, terms.
This feels like a save the game situation. <laughs> David Hayter might actually do that. Some sort <laughs> of Phoenix Wright meme thing. I made it He's pretty in, in, uh, must be exhausted, in tune with memes and stuff, right? It was no big deal. Snake, I'm <laughs> monitoring you closely. <laughs> your heart rate is elevated and your breathing is shallow. I said it was no big What's deal. What's the matter, Snake? You out of shape from all that dog mushing? <laughs> then climb down and proceed north. Certainly no Meryl. Good. You found a SOCOM. That's a Special oh. Operations Command pistol. Special it's Operations Command pistol. It's a caliber pistol with plenty of stopping power. It's also equipped with a LAM for nighttime combat. Mm. If you hold down the weapon button, you can train the laser sight on the enemy to help you aim. If you find a SOCOM suppressor, you can equip that too. That pistol was designed specifically for a use by special forces, so I think it will be useful. Nice. Some people find it a little heavy and hard to use, but it shouldn't be a problem for you. I think I have the suppressor and I never equipped it, huh? Oh, nice. David oh, Hader will say anything if you give him money. <laughs> Does David Hader have one of those, uh, what is it called? Cameo. Cameo, yeah, cameo account. I feel Probably. like he could make a uh, bank oh. from that. Otacon and then save. Otacon, I'm up on the roof. That was a pretty fast climb. I wanted to go slowly, but someone there forced me to move faster. Oh. Well, you can relax, because there's an elevator Thanks, in Tower Kojiro. B. Thank you. That walkway will take you to Tower B. I probably equipped it on a previous stream, yeah. You can see it. Ah, uh, extended barrel. Okay. Yeah, anyway. Gotta save it. What is it, Snake? He does have a cameo and was planning to get him to do something for me, Pinoy oh, says. Dude, nice. Pinoy. The mind cannot That's be awesome. in two places at once. Make sure that you're not thinking of something else during the mission, okay? <laughs> oh, you should re-equip your rations too. Thank you for the reminder. I appreciate it. But you needed the card to get in, right? Yeah. So is this going to be the actual encounter with Sniper Wolf? This is something. So that's a walkway. That's entrance to the other one. We've kind of switched gears, right? We're now we're trying. We're just pursuing, going straight to Liquid Snake, supposedly. Destroy Metal Gear. Or destroy Metal Campbell Gear. Oh, okay. Said. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We have one. Ooh. Did you get what um, Ocelot was talking about Russia earlier? How he. Wants to rebuild, help rebuild Russia. Yeah. And uh, this crew is in the talks of selling Metal Gear to Russia. Right, right. And he's not in it for the money. He's in it for the glory of Russia. And the Hind D. Hind D? Damn. The helicopter was a down payment from ah, Russia. Ah, right, 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 right. I'm afraid I can't let you get past here. Liquid. You're not going any Die. We don't know why Liquid Snake is or who he is, right? Yeah. We just know that he looks exactly like Solid Snake. Yes. Okay. And he keeps calling us it's a long brother. Down. Okay. If only I had a rope. I should be able to use that rope I got. What are you going to do? Take on a hind with your bare hands. Now you're Big Boss is our father is Snake's father. Here. Yeah, it, that's at least that's what Big Boss told him. Right. Okay, I'm trying to see what if I remember <laughs> what to do here. Okay. It's been a long time since I've done this. Wait, are you doing this? I just equipped the uh the rope. Oh. How and did you know this? He said uh, I've only had a rope. Good uh, thing I have a rope. Gotcha. 
<laughs> we don't know who he is or what he wants, but he looks damn good in a tutu. Did we know that? <laughs> the hell is going on? I don't remember this. Big Boss more like Daddy Boss. Oh my god. What? Press the X button to jump okay. away from the wall. While you're away from the wall, press down on the directional button. Oh, so we're just repelling okay. if you out of here. While pressing right or left on the directional button, you can make a big jump in that direction. Okay. If you press and hold the circle button while using the directional button... My dog, thank you so much for the thank follow. Thank you for the follow. If you're careful with the timing, you should be able to dodge the gunfire from the hind while you rappel down. If anyone can do it... Thank you so much you for the follow, Mike Dog. That was a little mini okay. dance party for you. So we're just trying to get out of here now. Yeah. Can I equip my freaking rations? No. Oh, no, you're good. Your health went back up. I was worried before. Oh, there's item over there. Ooh. Are those like steam vents or something? I think so. Uh, do they hurt you? Probably. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, I can't. <sighs> Close. <laughs> Action movie sequence time. Activate. We're in it. Oh Solid snake. Dude. Ouch, dude. Uh, this is hard to control. <laughs> oh, <God>. <laughs> that felt pretty silly. Equip the rations, dude. Where the, where's those quick time events? <laughs> not in, not here. Nope. Oh, God, Just okay. slow time events. Real real time events. Oh. Yeah, I saw this one's in Die Hard. <laughs> <laughs> Wee. C four. Oh, to get that door, maybe. Yes. Do I do it now? Is that now? Oh, you landed on the level on the perfect yeah. level. Oh. What the hell is going on? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're shooting out into nothingness? Oh, there's dudes there. Oh, there were? Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Is is I'm trying to remember. <laughs> maybe oh, oh, maybe uh -oh. I just blow up this door. <laughs> yeah, it seems like you can't go that way or something. There were dudes there. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Hey, Canal. Wait, the title says Wife's Playthrough, but the player is him. Correct. Um, We're kind of playing this together, uh, except technically Anthony is behind the controller. I've taken, I've taken it m once. Oh, gosh. Um, I don't remember what I'm supposed to do. For the torture scene, but it is... Technically, my first playthrough. Okay. My instinct is to go all the way back up on this side. As in, I've never experienced this game before. At least there's no uh, enemies this time. Okay. Okay. So, in my mind, that bridge was like uncrossable. Canal. Canal says so many girls don't like it when their boyfriends only play games and don't give them attention. Oh. I feel what? like for the most part you know, I'm not gonna lie, I have heard that before. But for Can the you most read it part, to me again one more time, please? Uh, so many girls don't like it when their boyfriends only play games and don't give them attention. Oh. That's uh I wouldn't blame the video games. <laughs> there's uh there's probably relationship issues in general there if that's, maybe if that's an issue. maybe <laughs> or do you get mad at me when i play too many video games when i'm when i'm stuck in loop hero and i'm Guys, not paying attention to you audrey when you find <laughs> the right game for audrey she gets addicted and over our uh break it was loop hero 
Yeah, we, we took like a week off streaming and I was like, and Anthony kept telling me, oh, Audrey, you should check out Loop Gear. I think you'll like it. And I was like, I've said it for like a few weeks, months now. Yeah. And I was like, oh, I don't know. You know, I don't know. Roguelike. Uh, Did I the just... aesthetic interest you at all? I, oh, I liked, I liked the look oh of it. Oh my God. I wasted my time. Oh, sorry. What? The door's busted. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. So you're not supposed to go this way. Well, at least you grabbed items along the way. Does anyone know? Am I supposed to go across the freaking walkway where the dudes are shooting at me? I genuinely don't oh, know. Oh, okay. Uh, I can look at the walkthrough. Sure, as well. please, please. Um, Koji does this random thought halfway up the stairs you pass Cloud Tape of Barrett. I had the same thought. <laughs> I had the same exact thought. The music starts warping. Okay. Oh, Blossom says, okay, Audrey saw his loop hero in like two sentences. Oh, I'm okay. so bad as, at, at conveying um and it's like selling people on things mm -hmm. this is that anthony excels at that he could sell you a piece of poop like he's so good at like like saying all the good qualities of something um for i don't know two sentences ultimately if it's not for you it's not for you <laughs> you can apply that to anything yeah <laughs> I mean, you don't have to like every I, video game. True. I wish I could. I wish I could too. Yeah. <laughs> Anthony saw me a piece of poop in five words. <laughs> Blossom, please buy this poop. <laughs> Did it work? <gasps> Canal says I made my mother play Final Fantasy VI and to the moon. She beat the two. She beat to the moon. As there's no challenge. Oh, gotcha. To the moon, I'm not familiar with, but how did your mother like Final Fantasy VI? I'm curious. I really loved VI. <sighs> um, Nao is addicted to Pokemon right now. Uh, the new it. one, the uh, Diamond and Pearl remake, Nao. Yeah, I think Nao said they were uh, playing it. Nice. Uh, Solid Snake says you do have to go through Daddy the guys in the walkway. While you may, all the time is still a flying, and this same flower that smiles today, tomorrow will be dying. Snake laughter is the best medicine. You should be happy you've got enough free time to play a game. Enjoy yourself, okay? Right, everyone? <laughs> Don't take it too seriously. Um, Solid Snake, thank you so much for answering uh, Anthony's question. Yeah, deal. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> thank you, Solid Snake. I appreciate it. <laughs> Coach, you know, how to solve poop in two sentences? It's by Akira Toriyama. <laughs> it's on a stick. <laughs> no refunds, Blossom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, am I dumb? I'm dumb. What do you need to do? Some snipe them. Yeah. Ah. Forgetting all the tools we have at hand, you know? It always happens. Oh, yeah. Like me and Ocarina. I don't have any more of that medicine. Oh, the uh, anti-anxiety. Yeah. God, dude, these freaking guys. Oh my god, this sucks. Oh no, how can you do? Oh you can't, my this god, it's impossible. You can't not. You can't do it in the middle of the. So what do I just wait for them to like come back? Yeah. Oh my god. Um, Canal, she liked it, but she was so bad. I Aww. gave up on in assisting. The two the moon series. Dude! Steam. Gotcha. Video games, dude. <sighs> nice. Dude. It's okay. Okay, then we wait for this dude to come back. You kidding me? I mean, it's uh taking a page out of Sniper Wolf's book. So wait days on end. Oh, oh my no. god, dude. Am I out of rations now? Uh, <laughs> oh, oh my god. Dude! Maybe from the other oh side. my god! He knocked me into the other Are room. Are they gonna respawn? Mm -hmm. I really hope not. It's because I put the key card on. <laughs> I oh should not. no! Yes. Oh god. 
nice. Try again. <laughs> Did I get them all? Nice. Now I'm out of freaking sniper bullets and rations. Oh, dude. We'll get more, I'm sure. Uh, what happened there, Neo? We Chaos. got knocked back because uh, Anthony equipped the key card and then it knocked him through the door. Should I even save? I just saved, right? You did. You okay. did. I think it might have been at the roof, but. Oh! Look at my health. <laughs> Are you serious? Cheap shot! He gets a shot in. Oh, you want to equip? Oh, okay. Stinger launcher. Stinger. Is it like a rocket launcher kind of thing? Portable. Surface to air missile. I Whoa. think that's what's <sighs> Is this a boss fight right now? Oh my god. Oh, I should have saved again right there. Maybe not. Nah, it's fine. Whatever. We have one ration. Nice. Okay. Pretty sure we're supposed to go up, so let's go down first. Because if there's more rations, we need it. Mm. This might give you motion sickness, Audrey. Okay. F. I think I'm supposed to go up. But you're exploring down in the name of... Oh, actually, I, I think right? I'm supposed to go down. Oh, you are supposed to go down. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, good, Fair good. Enough. Stairs are blown out. Okay, so we have to go up. We got all the items. Okay. It stings. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Feels like a boss fight, right? Yeah. Oh, is this, is this a cutscene, or are you? Yeah. You heard something. Sounded like someone got knocked out, maybe? Don't shoot! Oh! It's me, don't shoot! Nice. It's me, Snake! Otacon, how'd you get here? Well, it wasn't as dramatic as your entrance, <laughs> believe me. I'm afraid of heights. You were watching? Yeah, I was watching. I was riding in the back of their truck. Dude. Thanks to the stealth camouflage. How did you get up here? The elevator, of course. The first floor of the circular staircase was destroyed. That's why I took the elevator. The elevator was working? Oh. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> You're incredible. <laughs> like a movie hero or something. Is that something we could have tried? You're wrong. No, I don't think okay. so. In the movies, the hero always saves the girl. You mean Meryl? Sorry. Forget I said anything. Snake, there's something I've really got to ask you. It's why I followed you up this far. Have you ever loved someone? That's what you came to ask? No, I mean, I. Everyone always asks if them. Even soldiers fall in love. What are you trying to say? I want to ask you. Do you think love can bloom, even on a battlefield? Yeah, I do. I think at any time, any place, people can fall in love with each other. Hmm. But if you love someone, you have to be able to protect them. I think so too. I have a favor to ask. Uh-oh. Don't worry, it'll be easy. Um, I told you before I don't want to hurt anyone. I don't want you to either. Okay. The elevator is stopped down there. I want uh, you to get okay. it to move. You see? That's weird. It was working before, but now it isn't. Maybe the panel's broken. Can you fix it? It was working before. If it's the mechanism, leave it to me. I've got to go and swat a noisy fly. Okay. I'll stay here and hold the fort. Good luck. You really look like hell. Are you okay? Don't worry. 
If I do this, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I just you. pretend like I'm not here. And then I'm not scared. Aww. Strange logic. I'm counting on you. It's kind of like when you hide under the blanket. If you if they can't see yeah. me, then uh, the monsters won't get me. Kind it of. It is like his safety but, blanket then, huh? But, it, I mean, it is. I mean, I would feel safe yeah. with some sort of stealth as well. So I'm waiting on the elevator, I think, right? Um, <laughs> Coach, you don't, and now I'm thinking of a line from Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged. I've only seen a couple oh, of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged uh, things. Oh, yeah, I've, you know of it, though. Oh, Ooh, my God. The Come on! Series. Oh, man, you're already, like, <laughs> a, a sliver of life left. Um, Canal says, Kojima has never been good with dialogues. Wrong inspiration. Really? Dude, please. Oh, you use your last ration, I think. Um... I don't know. I like it. It's there's a certain level of campiness that you have to be okay with. There, yeah, you're that is right. Part of the charm of these games. It's gonna be more guns, huh? Very campy, pretty like edgy. Dude, we're gonna freaking die just going up the stairs. Can you like shoot those turrets or something? I don't or? think so. No. I mean, I'll try, but. No. No, Nothing really so. lets me aim yeah. in first person. I think they just want to bring your health down a little bit, maybe. Um, I'm going to die, though. Am I supposed to be going this way? Or uh, was I supposed to be waiting for the elevator? Oh, I don't know. He said, like, deal with the elevator while I swat down a fly. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Can you, uh, like, oh, please? Oh, Kojiro linked the clip in the Discord. Thank you, Kojiro. We'll okay. check it out later. Thank you. Yeah, those gosh darn, darn turrets, Nao. One ration. I think we're playing it on easy. Hey, Stardust. Love this game. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah, thanks for being here. Let me just check um, in with everyone and see. I'm enjoying it a lot so save. far. What is it, Snake? Lots of, um, lots of fun quirks. Character it's moments. Character moments Oops. and um, fourth wall breaking moments. Um, that I haven't really seen before. Yeah. Um, for, for me, anyway, personally, I mean, I haven't really seen that kind of, like, cute. Cheeky. Cheeky yeah. stuff. Um, you know, like, moving the controller into you the put next the controller slot. on your arm. Yeah. <laughs> we have put the controller on your arm. <laughs> yeah. For a game, what, so. 25 years old now? Dude. Yeah. Ration. Who the hell are you? I'm you. I'm your shadow. What? Ask the father that you killed. Ooh. Send you to hell to meet him. Hmm. We don't really know anything about the mother. Huh. Yes. Uh, we're going to do that. Maybe they're half brothers or something. We're going to do this. Don't tell me, by the way. I do not want to yeah. know. Do not tell Audrey anything. F. Oh, I see. I'm failing this. Huh. Um, Blossom says camp is a. Oh, Koi with the resub. Thank, Thank you so you much. Thank you so much. Koi. Boss fight mini dance party. I'll take care of it, Anthony. When Thank do I so shoot much, it? Koi. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm failing this really. You got it. I'm going to die, though. I feel like. Um, 17 months. Oi, koi, boy. Thank That's you so much. a long much. time. That is. Thank you. Camp is a good word for it. And maybe I'll also maybe blunt. He is not subtle oh. about his anti-war stance, which is one reason Metal Gear Solid is interesting. It's one of the first political games I know of. Yeah. I'm trying to think if I can think of anything... Like politically charged like this that I played as a video game. 
For me, not many. Or not, maybe none. Right, Canal. On the main menu, there's an option named Previous Missions, which tell what happened in MSX Metal Gear games. Right, 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 right. Yeah, we, we actually did that before we jumped into this playthrough. Um, so we were primed. We were primed a little bit before jumping in, into uh, Metal Gear Solid. Oops. What happens if you run out of... I should just use the ration, okay. Mm. Uh, I don't know. Out of missiles? Yeah. There are ways to deal with it, I think. Perhaps they give you some more. What does the chaff grenade do again? It messes up uh, communications oh. and stuff. No, 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 no. Thanks for being here, Solid Snake. Have a F. great night. Pressing and the wrong button. Hope you have a great day at work tomorrow. Um. Yeah, Kojito. Oh, I didn't know this, but uh, Kojito says they did that because the first two Metal Gear games didn't sell as well overseas. Metal Gear 2 didn't even come to the U.S. Oh. Uh. What does that mean? I don't know. I wish Konami would remake those games, Kanal says. And yeah, Stardust also. That would be awesome. I wonder if Konami would consider that, but I feel like, I don't know, because the relationship with Hideo Kojima. Mm hmm. I actually don't know what's going to happen if I run out of missiles. No spoilers, but <laughs> just telling you right now, that's what I'm wondering. Uh-oh. Oh. Why is there? Why did the music cut out? He's like lower. Oh. Second phase? Probably. Do you need to go down a floor? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Remember playing Metal Gear on my NES? Ah, yeah. Uh, and on. reading the World of Power book of the game. How do you? How did you like um, the book relative to the game? Did you find that the book helped your understanding? Konami rarely makes games of any kind anymore. Yeah. It's weird. They even made a new Getsu Gets Fuma Fuma Dead. May have spelled that wrong. I'm not. I'm not familiar with uh, all what that is. machines now, right? Oh, is that is that their main? Uh, their main thing Maybe now. Revenue. I mean, they probably Perhaps. make bank from those. Dude, the fake out. I uh, might be missing something, huh? Hmm. Canal says there's a really nice secret now in this part of the battle. Should I inquire? Feel free to tell us afterwards. Okay, tell us after, Canal. No, uh, I think we're going to steer clear of any um, anything like that for now. But thank you for letting us know. Pinoy says Sony is trying to get the rights for Metal Gear Solid from Konami. Oh, really? If they get it, Sony wants Hideo to remake the games. Whoa. That would be a huge get. I do not want to redo this. There's, uh, there's got to be something here. Uh, do you want me to look at the walkthrough? Maybe it says something about no. it. <laughs> like, 
I mean, I feel like just take it slow. It does not say anything. Because I feel like I have enough rockets as long as I don't mess up. He's going to pop out. He's going to shoot. Um, hey, mermaid, stealth, king, and queen. Hey, That's mermaid. That's kind of us. We've definitely got... Uh, We're trying. Gotten the attention of the guards several times, but, you know... We're stealthing. How are you doing, Mur? Shot. Nice. Yeah, Raptor, wasn't Konami Pachinko's now? Yeah, that's what Anthony was saying. So do I wait until he flies over? Because then he has to turn around. I, th I was really thinking it's throw the grenade. What am I doing? Uh-oh. <laughs> Did you drop two grenades? Yeah. Ah. Um, it was one of the books in my school library that I found and would check out for my English class when I could. Wow. Did you just happen across it in your school library and you're like, hey, Metal Gear Solid, I, I recognize this. Ah. Or did you seek it out? A forever, thank you, Mer. Uh, yeah, Kojiro says, wow. You're doing great. Slow and steady, slow and steady. Thank you, thank you very much. I needed that encouragement. I'm so sorry. Shot and exploded in his wow. face. Wow. It's okay. Don't apologize. Dude. It's okay. No, well, now you know the strategy. So, you know, we'll uh, take the it same. from the top. Oh, still only one ration? Yeah. Oh, no. Well, I guess no rations? There might be one outside. Yikes. Dude. Brutal. Okay. At least we can skip the cutscenes. Yeah. It's all right. You got this. Um, Kojiro says okay, my English class... So we class can be less reckless. Less reckless. My English class would go to the library once a week to check out a book. I saw Mega Man and Metal Gear and thought, well, I need to check out a book and I like games, so a Mega Man book. Whoa, that's cool. Okay, the hell am I doing? Didn't I just say... Well... <laughs> Okay. okay. I'm being You're being pretty reckless here. I just didn't remember how I dealt with the first phase. Ah, right, right, right. The same thing? Just let him fly by and then... It w worked for you before. In the second phase. The first phase, I was being just reckless because I didn't right. know what was going on. What? What am I... I'm just pressing Thanks. wrong buttons. Yeah, after a burst like that, you can poke out and then just one at a time. Yeah, strategy is don't shoot missiles into the wall in front of you. Yeah. Noted. Yeah, Kojiro looked up the Mega Man book again on eBay and found and bought a copy. Nice. Okay. I'm supposed to like step out and bait the attack. Oh, I, I meant Blaster Master, not Mega Man. I need to look for those two next. Blaster Master. Uh, we have a Blaster Master on um, PlayStation. Oh, yeah? Is it like a Mega Man-esque side-scrolling? Mm, it's, it's pretty different. It's a pretty oh, unique no. game. Oh, okay. Short stories about 50 plus pages. Nice. That's 
sounds like a fun read. Nice. Okay. Bit of a rhythm now. Over here. Aye. Oh, wasn't expecting that. Oh. Okay. Into the last ration now. What? No more rations. Sorry. Yeah, I mean, we you use the last one. What's that item there? That's not a ration, is it? It's more missiles. Okay. So does he always hit the same part of the building? Seems like it. We're good, right? We have 10. Okay. There's more to pick up down there. The books gave me more story to the original games since the NES wasn't exactly a storytelling machine. You're talking about the Metal Gear books. The World of Power books. Now, are those official... I'm going to um, hit the wall again. I just feel it. <laughs> don't jinx yourself. Um, are those official, like, Konami licensed books? Or are they, like, fan written? Or? Plenty of missiles. Just don't get too close to the wall, I think. When I pop oh, out Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this lull in the fight feels... I think there's something I can do there. That's why I was trying to throw grenades over the ledge. Okay. But there's, I'm missing something. I must be missing something. I didn't like the angle though. That's okay. Better to take it safe. <laughs> you were gonna try the grenade? I did. Oh, you did? Oh, but it. It didn't hit him. Oh. It does feel like that, that might be a thing then. I thought so. <laughs> it really feels like it might be something, yeah. doesn't it? It's fine. Your your current strategy is working out nicely. Just take it slow, but it's safe. Methodical. I'm not sure how it's supposed to work. Like, yeah, I don't know, dude. You'd have to time it and know where. Maybe it's the C4. I don't know. But you, do you throw the C4? I don't think so. I don't know. I don't. I wouldn't think so. Yeah, the guide that this uh, spoiler-free guide doesn't really say anything about it. Yeah, it doesn't talk about strats, huh? No. It did. It did with the. Um,
Hey, Zynthio, what's up? Hey, Zynthio, how are you doing? I'm like stressing. The out guy right does now. indicate about the controller thing in uh, the Psycho Mantis fight. Gotcha. Happy New Year to you, Zynthio. Happy New Year. Thank you. Thanks for tuning in. We are currently in this. Behind helicopter <laughs> shootout. Taking it slow and steady. We have no rations. Maybe like three more of those should do it. Like maybe two. Two. Taking it slow. Taking it easy. Yeah. I did I get it that time? No, okay. I don't think he did. I think he just yells when he shoots. <laughs> yeah, cuddly snuggle fight, I see. Oh, yeah. It's very intimate. Kojudo, okay, not buying one of those books off Amazon. Not going to shell out $50 for a little short story. Probably $50 because they're out of print now. I keep trying it. Oh, he went yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's playing safe now. Yeah. left. I think that's good. Yeah. You got this. Thank you. Solid on radar, dude. <laughs> yeah. What were you using the chaff grenades for earlier? To mess them up so I could peek out. Oh. But I, I don't know if that actually works. I see. But it also messed up my radar. Mm. Here we go. Yeah. Oh. We'll see. Uh, which side now? Which side do you think? What? What do you mean? The big... Is he going to do a big boom, right? I don't... Or not? I don't know. You're not... Protect? I thought he said die because he's going to do bombs again. Okay. Okay, here we go. I don't know where it's going. Oh, God. <laughs> what? I think it's... I think it's a story one. Okay. <sighs> you did it! Thank you. Nicely done. Snake. Was that Liquid Snake yelling snake? Yeah. Or was that Solid Snake yelling snake at Liquid Snake? God, was so tense. <gasps> like a stomach ale. Do you know? Liquid. No, that can't be <sighs> the end of Liquid Snake. Yeah, Raptor, we did it. Thank you guys that for cheering me on. Oh my god. That can't be the end. We didn't Whoa. see it. It happened off screen, so for sure. More max health? Don't yeah. actually confirm. We ha we do not have closure <sighs> with that. Snake, the elevator's working. You fixed it? No, that's the weird thing. It just moved by itself. It's oh. Right Is that so? Okay. That explosion before, what was it? Oh, I had to take out that helicopter. <laughs> helicopter? That's incredible, Snake. Listen. Tian with the raid! Tian with the raid, thank you so much. Is being stored. Welcome, yeah. everyone. The 
entrance to the underground maintenance dance base party is for Tien. How are you doing? Head. Okay. Oh, we got a, a we, got <laughs> we got a lot of butts and butt <laughs> raid. I know, I know. You don't have Thank to you so much, Tien. Thank you, everyone. We just a finished a boss later. fight. Okay. Call me if you need to. How was Final Fantasy to the north. Seven? Is where we're going. Okay, to the north. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Thanks for being here. Thank you, TN, for the raid. We really appreciate it. <laughs> Hi, everyone. My name is Anthony. I'm Audrey. Together, we make up this channel, re and -E. Audrey and I stream separately and together on the channel. Mm. Today, for our weekly duo stream, we are playing through Metal Gear Solid 1 from Metal 1998. Gear Solid, yes. This is the original PlayStation 1 version. Um, I have played this before, but this is Audrey's first time. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. um, And we're about... Ooh... We just finished a boss fight. We're, yes. we're kind of well into the game now. So for those of you who haven't played and want to avoid spoilers, we totally feel understand. free. We totally understand. Um, but just a fair warning, um, we are well into the game. So and it has very exciting things. And Lie Rep, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you for the follow and the cheer from TN. Happy New <gasps> TN! Year. TN, thank you so much for the cheer. Happy New Year to you too. Thank you so much. Uh, how many of you guys have played this game Thank before you, or um, are fans of Metal Gear? Tian, I don't know. I don't think you have any experience with Metal Gear, right, Tian? Um, oh, thank you all for the kind words. Yeah, Kyber, listen! <laughs> we were hey, on Kyber. Monday. We were. I'm working through Ocarina of Time. Um, and Tian says 7 was fun. That's good to hear. Always, always love. Glad to hear that. Hearing... People have fun with Final Fantasy VII. I know how to deal Namely with the you. stupid turrets now. It's the chaff grenades. Ah, of course. Um, how's it going, everybody? I'm going to switch to first person once in a while. Sorry. Sure. Style snake, snake, snake. Yes, we, we did get the game over screen a couple times. Um, Gwen, how's it going? Greek Nords. Um, and Daring, hello, hello. Hey, and up? Happy New Year to you too, Gwen. Riku, what, which uh, boss did you finish? We just fought. Did you see him going crazy? Nice. We just fought Dance Hind the helicopter. So today we we went through the Psycho Mantis fight, um, and we after that we did a an encounter with Sniper Wolf, mm -hmm. and we just did the helicopter uh, Hind fight mm -hmm. with a uh, Liquid Snake. So yep. uh, I don't know who's dead for sure. Don't tell me. No spoilers. This is my first first time experiencing this game, so. So what did Otacon just hind say? Hind or Hind D? It's Hind space letter D. It so just only said Hind right there. Oh, oh. But so when they were talking about it, they said the full name Hind D. Oh, Hind D. Okay, okay, sorry. I was saying it wrong. No, no, you were saying Hind. Oh, Hind is okay. H-I-N-D space D. Oh, Hind D. Oh, I see. Riku Nord with the follow. Thank, Thank you, you so much, much. Riku Nord. <sighs> um... Riku Nord, so I put I put all of the save files that are appropriate for this into the memory card in order for um, Audrey to get the full experience. Wendy, New Year's was very low key for us. We just stayed home and um, had dinner, made dinner. Yes, yes, we did. Hyper Fiji, thanks for being here. And just to and catch up, sorry, um, uh, Otacon said, I don't know. The elevator just moved on its own. As soon as the, as we defeated Hind, coincidence? I don't know. Um, Snowman's, I love the Metal Gear Solid series. Yeah, Anthony's very fond of the series as well, and um, I've been interested in a long time, so I'm I'm happy to be experiencing this first Metal Gear or Metal Gear Solid One. We we d we decided to not play Metal Gear One and Two, and we just went through the uh, little recap. What? Uh oh. Oh, cause the jamming thing? No, I don't know. You did it, Snake. You shot down the hind. I was so worried. Liquid couldn't have survived that. I wonder. But even so, just because we've taken out their leader doesn't mean they're gonna give up. They're still gonna try to launch that nuke. You're right. There's no time to waste. Hurry. The underground base is past the communications tower. The elevator's working again, isn't it? Uh-huh. Mmm. I'm gonna call it autocom. Yeah, I think that's probably... I don't know why. But the elevator just started working again. If you take it all the way to the bottom of Tower B and go outside, you'll be in the snowfield. 
The entrance to the underground maintenance base is in the north of the snowfield. Um, okay. Rico only played two to five, including Revengeance. Gotcha. Yeah, someone was mentioning okay, Revengeance yeah. earlier and, was, and uh, was recommending it, even though it's technically not a main line um, game. So, yeah, interesting. No man's. I've played this that many Triple times. Triple Hydrate, too. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, love seeing people play them for the Snake, first time. There's something I forgot Ooh. to tell you before. What? There were five stealth camouflage prototypes in my lab. Yeah, so? If you take out the one I'm wearing, that leaves four. Hey, this isn't first grade math class. <laughs> I thought I'd get one for you. So I went back to the lab and... <gasps> yeah? The four suits were missing. Also, about the elevator that I checked out, it's really strange. It was like someone was intentionally holding it. When you were riding on it, did the weight... Oh! That's another thing that bothered me about it. The warning went off, and I know I couldn't be over the limit. How much do you weigh? About 135. But that elevator had a weight limit of 650 pounds. Well. It would take at least five people to go over that limit. Look out! <laughs> the guys who stole my stealth prototypes are in there with Oh you. my god, you couldn't have said that before we got on that one. Too late, Snake. Now die! Oh! Do we know the voice? Also, how come he didn't remember the stealth suits while we were in the lab? <laughs> we could have used that this whole <laughs> this whole time. <laughs> um, let's see here. Hyperfg played all Metal, Ge Metal Gear. Is very nice, including Metal Gear Acid. I should say the only Metal Gear game I played was Metal Gear Acid for, uh, on the PSP, and my understanding is that that is no longer Ooh. canon. So ration. Oh, okay. Oh, Tian's going to the Coliseum soon in uh, in his playthrough. Nice. 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 Very nice. <gasps> Love exciting it. Time. That is very exciting. <sighs> Thank you for keeping up with chat, Audrey. I appreciate it. Yeah, of course. I'm just trying to stay alive. I, I love keeping up with chat. <laughs> oh, yeah. And you answered, Riku, about the uh, Mantis stuff fine on your on the uh, memory card. Yes, I yeah. did. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. The exit. I just want to make sure we get any items that are here. These are the stairs that were broken. Yeah, Pinoy, is it just me or this game doesn't give you a break with boss fights? It is not just the you. The pacing is intense, for yeah. sure. Or at least today, it just seems like go, go, go. Like after Psycho Mantis, it was like go through this, and then mm -hmm. suddenly you're, you're getting encountering sniped. was, yeah, you're yeah. getting sniped by a sniper world. And Abin with the follow, thanks so Thank much. Thank you so much. I can I can join in on the mini dance party now. Yeah, you can actually release the controller <laughs> for a second. All right, let's. A lot oh, has happened. Raptor. Let's check in. Let's check in with the characters. Avoiding seven spoilers. Yes, no more no no more spoilers yes. for anything. Please only, be careful. Only let's only talk about um, Metal Gear Solid up up to this point. Yeah, <laughs> up to this point. Uh, for me. All right, let's check in with everyone. Okay. The entrance to the underground maintenance mm -hmm. base is somewhere towards the back of the snowfield north of Tower. Yep, you said that. Plan your strategy based on the enemy's positions. Try to think like... Okay, just general stuff. Yeah. Um, Snowman's, yeah, Metal Gear 1 and 2 can be pretty rough. I think Metal Gear 2 still holds up okay, but Metal Gear 1 is really, uh, really rough. Yeah, it seems like... It's, I think someone else said, yeah, they were really difficult, and uh -huh. they must have just refined it over Maybe time. Maybe a little dated. Gone. Which direction yeah. is the underground base? It's in the snowfield to the north of Tower B. The door is security level 6. Six. Hey, yeah. Solar Star. Wow, Otacon's still around? It's been 20 years since I last met him. He's, a a, he's alive and kicking. In this game, at least. Um, as long thanks for as being the here. strategy of nuclear deterrence continues, nuclear weapons may be reduced, but they will never be eliminated. If you think about it, nuclear reduction does not mean much without elimination as the ultimate goal. I used to work in the DIA. I figured the only way to achieve nuclear elimination was to work from the inside to convince them of the ineffectiveness of the deterrence theory. Seems like you're pretty focused on that issue. Victims of nuclear radiation are a sad thing to see. And I have seen a lot of it. I have seen more than enough of it. Oh, I was born and raised in Pripyat, Ukraine. I was 10 years old on that day, April 26, 1986. 
you don't mean. Yes, mm. Chernobyl. That is the day that changed my life and thousands of other lives. I live just three kilometers north of there. 600,000 to 700,000 people were evacuated. Over 650,000 children suffered the effects of radiation poisoning. Between 1986 and 1993, 12,000 children died. My parents and many others like them who helped in the cleanup died a few years later from radiation sickness. We must rid this world of all nuclear weapons before they cause more misery, before they destroy the delicate environment that keeps us alive. I will not allow this pain and anxiety to pass on to yet another generation. It's so interesting how they actually, they interweave real life events into this game. Mm -hmm. Like this and the Watergate scandal mm -hmm. and um, there were other things, but... They talked about like World War II, yeah, Manhattan Project. It's yeah, pretty interesting. Yeah, it's science fiction, historical fiction. Yeah. But it helps really inform the plot and the character motivations really well. Yeah, yeah. Filling out these characters' backstories. Mm, 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 mm. Oops. And Mei Ling. Um, you caught Snake? Kojiro didn't have many Konami games when I played this, but I did have Azure Dream. So that must have nice. blown your mind when, uh, when, when uh, we had the Mantis, save, right? Yeah, man <laughs> man Mantis. Or when we had the save, but when you yeah. encountered Mantis. Don't forget to save your memories of me, too. And, and uh, well, he was save like. Memories, even on that system of yours. Oh. Memories are fragile things. After you reduce them to binary numbers and send them through the air, they're not memories anymore. I wouldn't be so sure of that. There's nothing my system can't do. Memories aren't just sounds and pictures. They exist somewhere between the sounds, between the picture. I don't get it. Anything can be done digitally. If that's true, why don't you go ahead and try to say what I'm thinking right now? I can't say that type of thing. You have to put it into words at least. That's right. And that's what memories mm. are. Wordless. I don't know about that. No matter how far data technology advances, you'll never be able to penetrate the human heart. You're wrong. It's just... Whoa! But first you have to try to understand human emotions, Mei Ling. And how do I do that? You have oh. to allow yourself to fall in love with someone. For, for for someone who's so philosophical as Mei Ling, I'm surprised she said something like that. Yeah. She like is she has like a a library of sayings. Yeah. But she's very much a technology person. I yeah. think. True. But she like can maybe recite the sayings. Yeah. Maybe she doesn't have the life experience is what um Snake is kind of saying. Oh, mm, I see, I see, I see. Um, oh yeah, and Abin, yes, thank you, and we're so appreciative to SARS for the raid. Yeah, SARS is awesome. Yeah, we, yeah. We've been following SARS for like maybe a year now, huh? Uh, yeah, I think like. so. Yeah, and yeah, she's always been so wonderful to us. I think we met her when you were playing Final Fantasy VI a year ago, something like that. Definitely a Final Fantasy game. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. So, thank you all so thank much you for guys being so much. here. This is a good spot to stop for now. Yeah, yeah. How do you feel? <laughs> I feel great. I'm. I'm. I apologize for the uh, fumbling through the game. It has been a couple no, weeks no. since we last played. I the, some of the things I remember in this game really vividly, and some things I'm just like, what? Mm. What do I do? Yeah, yeah. So we appreciate you guys being conscious of our spoiler and backseating policies in chat, yeah. and uh, helping us out to make sure we enjoy mm. this game. Mm. For, again, for our duo streams in which Audrey and I play games together, mm. um, we are not seeking the most challenging gameplay. We're usually playing things on easy, but taking it slow to absorb and discuss and uh, enjoy the story. That's yeah. why we're here. Yeah, and there's a lot of story. Yeah, and how are you game. feeling about it? We got. We, I feel like we've had a lot of longer conversations with characters in the stream. True. Yeah, we're. I love kind of um, like hearing more about the foxhound characters because I already knew. I was like these. Every one of them is going to have a different story. Yes. And um, and I'm glad that that is the case so far. Yeah. Um, We're getting a big old chunks of them. Yeah, yeah. So I, I still have a lot of uh, gaps about the story as a whole. Okay. I, I, I mean, they're, they're d slowly feeding things. Are you worried it's like a memory or a comprehension thing on your part? 
No. So do you feel like it's a deliberate trickle feeding of information to you? Well, I mean, they, they've kind of fed, you know, I mean, there's things like uh, with Donald since the beginning. I mean, pretty early on, it was like, okay, something s- strange is here. I just don't know what it is. And then suddenly we see his. So we thought he died at the beginning of the game, which would be a couple hours ago in our mm. in-game time. Yeah. Um, and then suddenly we we're, were in this room with his decomposing body, which yeah. seems to be have been dead for days. Yeah. So who was it that was in that room with us who had the heart attack? Mm-hmm. Um, we don't know. It, a lot I of mean, questions. The, the appearance-wise, it looks just like Donald. So, and but I mean, and it makes you think because there's another guy walking around that looks just like Solid Snake. So I don't know. Is there some shenanigans going on there? Sure. Um, don't know. Um, I really genuinely appreciate your perspective and asking all these questions because those of you in chat probably have the same sentiment of thing as me. I wish I could just forget this game and mm. experience it for the first time all over again. And I'm the next best thing is to get to watch Audrey make predictions and mm. ask all these questions and be skeptical about every little bit of information mm. and just witnessing that these characters do have all of their own separate agendas. Like you're trying to stop and think like, what are they trying to do? Mm-hmm, what are they trying mm-hmm. to say? Is Are they telling us the truth or are they not, you know? Yeah. Um, yeah, but yeah, it's pretty clear. Everyone has their own agenda. Mm-hmm. No one seems to be really like um, lawful good <laughs> yeah. or anything like that. So, um, but but that makes it interesting. So I, I, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it a lot. Yeah, and I'm, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, lots of butts. <laughs> yeah. What's not to like. Yeah. Actual butts in this game. For those of you yeah. who don't know, there was like uh, like the first part of this stream was all about this butts. one character's butt. Yeah. <laughs> and it was like, you guys know. You it guys was, know. You know, it was probably gratuitous, but yeah. it, it, it's like like kind of funny and charming in its own way. Charming, I think, is. In its own 1998 way. Yeah. Um, yeah, shot a heli, time to sleep, Raptor. I think that <laughs> we, it was all in a good, all in day's work. Yeah. I'm mm-hmm. really enjoying, I'm really glad that you're enjoying the tone of the game it's like at times serious at times you know silly but it's just right on that line of like campy yeah it's like anime hyper serious sometimes you know oh yeah yeah but but I'll, at the same time not taking itself too seriously this is exactly where i like to be yeah <laughs> in life as well yeah not too serious <laughs> not too a little bit serious a little bit funny yeah. and butts yeah. but thank you guys very much for watching um check our schedule down below um, as I said, Audrey and I stream separately and together on our channel. So for our uh, for our duo streams, we are playing Metal Gear Solid right now. For Audrey's solo streams, she last streamed on Monday, two nights ago. Mm-hmm. She's working through her very first playthrough of, of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Yep. So more of that next week on Monday, correct? For yep. more Ocarina? Yes. So tune in if you want to watch Audrey experience Ocarina of Time for the first time. Mm-hmm. Tomorrow is my next solo stream. I'm working through a JRPG on the Nintendo 3DS called Radiant Historia. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to be working on that tomorrow and Sunday. <laughs> and then Friday on our schedule, I'm trying to hop into some more Final Fantasy 14, just casually trying to get through that story and catching up. I uh, am in post Stormblood, if that makes sense for any of you. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's it. Yeah. Metal Gear Solid. Ocarina of Time, Radiant Historia, and Final Fantasy XIV. That's what's happening on our channel. Um, feel free to check our schedule and tune in. Uh, <laughs> yeah, charming butts, Valborn. Butts and butts and bras. We can't forget about very, the bras. Very important, yeah. Exactly yeah, butts right, seems to be a focal point of the, the conversation right now. That's going to be the title of this VOD, just butts. Yeah, that's up to you. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> and Tian, uh, thank you for linking it. Yes, thanks, we are on Tien. social, Instagram and Twitter mm. and our Discord. A lot of you guys are already on our Discord hanging out, talking about all kinds of things, including video games. Mm. And if you want to rewatch any of our VODs or miss or check up, check any playthroughs of our games in the past mm. that you may have missed, um, we YouTube. recommend youtube.com slash Rianny. We put higher quality recordings of our VODs mm. on YouTube. You can, of course, watch the VODs here on Twitch, but uh, YouTube has higher quality recordings. That's right. And uh, there's also a link that TN put in chat to a, a Google Docs spreadsheet listing all of the games that we've streamed so far. Mm. And it also links to um, the playlists for each. So if you're curious about what we've done on stream so far, that uh, that link is... Uh, it's fun to look at. It's kind of nice to look back on what we've done so far. Mm. Yeah, yeah, King Baboon, I have never played this. Whoa. It's 
it's a treat. It's a treat. And hopefully you're yeah. enjoying experiencing it for, for the first time here. with me. It's It's been a lot of fun. And um, Kojito asks, how many games let you use the word shenanigans to describe parts of it? Blossom says, to be fair, most of the games they've played have featured the word, and it's true. Yeah. yeah oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. We, 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 got, we play games with a lot of shenanigans. Yeah. Time shenanigans. Time shenanigans might be the best. Yeah. We, lo we love uh, time shenanigans. Yeah, we love it. Um, Tian, best mod. Yes, we appreciate you so Thank much. Thank you so Tien. much, Tian. You You're so right, Valborn. Great, um, great mod. So, yeah, I think we're about done. I think we'll try to find someone to raid. Yep. But that does it for us. Thank you all again. My name is Audrey. And I'm Anthony. Together, we make up this channel, Rianny. We appreciate hanging out with you guys and looking forward to hanging out again in the next stream. Have a wonderful night. Thank you all.